Right, let's try that again then, is it? I have to reboot the little PC. It was it decided. Oh, you don't live stream, you? Uh, tell you what, look, but I'll um I'll do an update, is it? That's practically what I done. So I had to sort of escape from that a minute to reboot the PC to make it behave. So a little bit inconvenient, but nonetheless, we are here. We are live. I think anyway, hang on. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Right. Let's just get that screen up ready. While well, I sort out up ah, to go live on the vertical. Right. Oh, it's saying I'm live. Give it a chance now in a minute. There we are, look. There we are. Oh, hang on. YouTube has been a bit of a funny bugger now on the start screen. On the main one. Right, that should do. Right. Live chat on that. And live chat by there. Should be catching up now in a minute. Yes, there we are, that'll do. Not the quickest encoder in the world, but considering it in the valleys with coal powered internet connection, it'll do. Hi, right, so how are we all? How are we all this morning? It's actually quite sunny in Wales for a change. It's quite a bit of a change. I don't know what to do for the best. It'd help if I connected my controller as well. There we are. Game bad mode activated. Yeah, so on yesterday's stream, we managed... <laughs> we actually achieved quite a fair bit. I was quite surprised. We managed to find a, both a truffle and a pomegranate on the same day for the bundles. So we managed to complete the bulletin board. So all we need now is a bit of wool. And we've already got a rabbit ready for that. So hopefully that'll be done by the end of the year. Latest. And then all we need then are the winter forageables. So they're the only two left, which means we've got access to the skull cavern now. And I'll be honest, this is probably the sort of the best sort of progress I've done on a Stardew run up to now. Because normally I struggle with either the things like the fish and or like money cash flow and stuff to upgrade everything in time. Not as a chill in the air, it could just be the approach of winter, or it could be the tingle of a dark spectre, here to help us celebrate tomorrow's festival, the Spirit Eve. Come to her at 10pm if you'd like to participate. Mayor Lewis. Oh yeah, the other lad was Haley when I was saying she enjoyed taking photos of the cows. I had to do a bit of a test run first, because I'm still playing about with the settings on the vertical. So if there is anyone looking at the vertical a minute, could I just get your opinions on how much of the screen you can see? Is it enough? Is it not enough? And so on and so forth, basically. Right, I was going to say, Pamela doesn't get to the bus until about 10 p.m. 10 a.m. anyway, so there's no point rushing. So I may as well poodle about doing all this stuff. Right, attach that. Marvellous. Oh, there's a little bunny rabbit. There we are. Got the duck, but there now. Got cow number one. And cow number two. Right. Let's sort all this out then. We got a wool. Crikey, that was quick. I wasn't expecting that so soon. And now I can't pick it up. Such is the gameplay that I'm doing at the minute because of the money and all that. I haven't got the last bag upgrade yet. So, I'll tell you what, how much does that duck mayonnaise? It's only... It's not that much, see, I don't think it's worth taking as recovery recovery item. Right, don't think I'm going to need an axe. Might do with the O. Or the scythe. I mean, that's not really worth bringing. Yeah, because we've got 98 on the large egg. It's not that... Mm, it's very debatable at the minute. Tell you what, sell a lot of it and just start again. I should have I should have been making some cheese for these runs, to be honest. Right. That can stay in. That can stay in. These can stay in for gifts. 
Coral can go back. That can go there. Right. Sell, 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 sell. Sell, 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 sell. 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 Right. I know this seems a little bit backwards. Ah, oh, there we are, mine do. Or cake. Everything's better than cake. Got an autumn's bounty. And a chocolate cake. Right. I think I'll do alright with that for now. If I'm honest. And oh, I just put those eggs. I sold those eggs, didn't I? I meant to make mayonnaise. To make more money. Never mind. Tis life. Oh, itchy nose. Right. Ah, have I got cheese by there? I'll keep all of that. I'll keep all of that one today then. Bless me. Thought I was itching to sneeze. Oh. Yeah, they could go. Oh, right. Where's the other cow? How can I miss the other cow? Nope. Ah, there it is. There we are. Sorry, Daisy. There we are. Right, put the paler back. So I don't want to be losing that. Oh, and i got to try and save up. Hopefully get enough money to get a heater for the coop. Because I haven't got one in the coop. I got one for the cows, because I got given one from Marnie's bundle. Oh, hang on. Tell you what, I'll do that bundle tomorrow now. For the wall. I'll leave the wall there for now. Because Pamela's about to get to the bus. Right. Here's a little trick as well. If you sort of obstruct her like that, she'll start shaking. After questioning. Oh no, she won't shake, but she'll go faster. Which is a little bit better. And I think if you do that from the start of her walk into the bus, that can save a fair bit of time. It's quite surprising how quickly, how more quickly she goes there. So that's a useful little tip if you want to get it a bit quicker. I think it's something like I worked out like 30 in-game minutes or something. It was quicker by. It was quite remarkable actually how much of a difference it made. Right. And I forgot my prismatic shard, didn't I? Ah. Palm fossil. Yeah. So you need your prismatic shard for you, don't we? Nuts. Tell you what. If I get some of these forageables a minute. Hopefully I can make enough money back to go back to Stardew to get my prismatic shard <laughs> and come back again. Ah, oh. thinking typical, isn't it? I knew there was something on the back of my mind. A little bit of grey tissue in the back of our head, thinking we forgot something. Thinking, well, what? I'm not going to tell you that. And so, of course, you carry on then. And then, as soon as it becomes too late, like me just going here. It just said, if you got your prismatic shard, thinking, ah, this is what it is, isn't it? Right, ooh, a customer. Sandy is her name, is it? Hi, welcome to Sandy's Oasis. Hey, look, let's the new farm that Emily wrote to me about. It means the bus line to Stardew Valley is back in service. Ooh, I'm so happy. Well, if I had more money, I would be a bit happier, because I'd be buying star fruit. Right, oh, hang on, see if she can buy my forageables off me. No, she can't. Right, okay. Ugh, I'm a bit stumped now. Oh, unless this trader by here can buy my forageables. I don't see why he'd want to buy them off me when he can just go up and walk and pick them up himself. But, I'll tell you what, emeralds. That might be a good thing, actually. Where was the cheesy grass? Yes, it was an emerald. Do a bit of fan of the opera. 999 coal. Well, that's actually quite deceiving me. Quite difficult, I suppose. I like to do a lot of wood. I think it's wood in the coal maker. Right. I fluffed up for there. So, because I want to get the galaxy sword before going to the skull caverns. Because I can't imagine my playthrough being any good. Well, I'm not good at the skull caverns anyway. I'm not going to lie about that. But let's get the prismatic shard first. Just so I know I've got it to hand. 
sell those forageables to see if I'll see if PA will accept them actually. Well, I'm here. Have I got emeralds? Oh, I got an emerald. I technically need to give that to Gunther. Speaking of which, I'll get that fossil sent to him straight away. Right, this is not a really good start to the Skull Cavern run, is it? Because I got no money to go back at the minute. Because I forgot my prismatic shard. And now I'm going to the museum, so it's a very misleading title at the minute. I'm not going to dispute that. Don't need the museum. Ha, but he's not having that. He can... He can get lost if he thinks he's having my prismatic shard. Got a new reward anyway. Collect rewards. Skeleton. Oh, I should have just left it with him. Tell you what, can I actually leave that in here? I mean, because I don't want to go back to the farm. Yeah, hi, I can. Amaze balls. Right. Let's try PAs then. See if he'll buy these forageables off me. To get, to get a ticket back to the Skull Cabin, basically. I know it'd be pretty much a bit of a waste today you now, but. I'll have more money in tomorrow's play in tomorrow's anyway. Oh yeah, he'll buy a fair bit off me. Right. Oh there we are. Should have enough now then. Oh crikey yeah. Oh I pretty much made my money back then. Well that's not too bad then. That's not too bad. Right, let's try again then. A little bit late for the Tell Caverns because I messed up. I forgot my prismatic shard, but nonetheless. Let's try again. No. Oh, an arrowhead. Don't think I got that one yet. Well, I'm not going to Gunther now. There we are. Let's try again. Pew. Right, so yeah. What I was saying earlier, if we bring a prismatic shard to here, I think, here we are. You get the galaxy sword. Prismatic shard changed shape before your very eyes. This power is tremendous. You found the a galaxy sword. Marvelous. So yeah, it's unlike anything you've ever seen. Unlike anything I've ever seen so far. Right. Let's give this skull cavern a lock in, is it? I'm not all full of any sort of achievement today. I'm not prepared for it. I just wanna this is new. Hmm, what that does? You inserted the skull key into the keyhole. It's a perfect fit. Ah, I wonder if he'll do something now then. No, never mind. Alright, never mind. They say we'll find out some sooner or later. Ah, that doesn't do nothing, does it? Aha! Ooh, spicy eel. There we are. Yeah, because I know at some point now. I'm not sure if I've got access to making them yet. But what I want to do is make... Uh, there's some of the forgeable rings you can make. With some of the items. Can't remember what they're called. But they like literally act as a glow ring, magnet ring. And it buffs your attack up by like 10% as well. I definitely want to make that one. And obviously I think there's another one then you can have that buffs defence up on his own, like. So it's not as good as the first ring. But the first one is amazingly overpowered in my opinion, because you've got like a 10% attack buff. And it acts as a magnet ring. And it acts as a glow ring, all in one ring. It's the one ring to rule them all, basically. But it's amazing. There we are. Oh. Get him! There we are. Ooh, got the staircase as well. 
I'm wondering what's up here. Doesn't look like nothing much. I'll risk it for now. There we are. Oop. Uh, I always a little bit too late. Oh, that was the timing. There we are. There we are. Now, sometimes I don't know whether that was the noise of it being defeated or another one coming. Tell you what, let's preempt anything. Because there's always a bit of a rush when you're under a swarm. So let's get recovered now. Right, I know my escape. So let's go have a bit of a discover because it's some iridium ore. Wouldn't go amiss at the minute. Just a star topping up on that. Uh, nothing much here. So let's crack on down enough. Aha! Speaking of a radio ball. I think it is anyway. Amazing. So it's the start of it at least anyway. This is what I was saying in yesterday's stream. I'd rather have at least the steel pick in the Skull Cavern. I mean, it's taking a bit. It's taking longer than it needs to be now. In fairness, oh, and I've already filled out my itinerary, my items. Oh yeah, it's rather cool. What's that? Logo cap, a pink cap with a sleek profile. Um, well, I can't see me wearing it, but I mean, it won't hurt for now to keep hold of it in case I do fancy doing a bit of fancy dress. Bit of copper beer. I mean, I'm saying I don't really need copper much anymore now, but some of the recipes call for it, so it's always good to have a bit of a top up now and again. Right. No. And again, it'd be handy if I'd managed to get this, the iron hoe. But obviously, I was trying to get the money saved up for the Skull Caverns to gain access to it. So. Right, so this place is overrun with monsters. Wait a minute. Right. Ooh, bit of a video more. Never hurts. Right, let's defeat them. Got some new ideas to sleep on. Tidy. Right. Again, we know how to escape. Let's see what's in here. Uh, nothing. Not many ores anyway, so let's just crack on for now. Oh, right. Over for some Omni Geos as well. So we can try and get them. So we can try and get some more artifacts for the museum that we are. Amazing. <clears throat> Speaking of which, can I make any more of them? Boom boom bulls. Yeah, I can. There we are. That's like probably the best way that can happen. I think that's the other ring I wouldn't mind giving a bash at either. Is um, I think that, I think there's a wearable ring you can wear that makes you immune to the slimes, and I would say they're probably the most common enemy you come across in these places. So that might be well worth 
a lock. Oh, right, okay. Right. Run away! Run away! Oh, there we are. Ooh, got a hole. Ugh, I've got a ruby and nowhere to store it. Right, sorry, pink cap. Needs must. Stone. There's a shaft leading down. Jump in. You fell 13 levels. Nice. Better do it. Ooh, serpentine. Right. Ooh, it hurt me. Right, run away. Aha. Ooh, we got a treasure floor. I wasn't expecting one so soon. What are we hoping is going to be? Well, I can worst case and get rid of the Aquamarine, I think. Oh, mind you, saying that. If I go any... Tell you what, I can eat the cheese. If I eat both of them. Uh, no, I don't want to waste it. I tell you what, the clay can go, I think. So I don't want to waste the cheese for the sake of it. So... Oh, white turban. What is, that? is that just a wearable item or has it got special powers? A fine white silk turban with blue trim. Oh, but no more. I may have to give that a look. I'll keep hold of that. I can't go old cat mine. I'll definitely be giving that a go. I tell you what, they might. Some, uh, I was going to say, sometimes I'm lucky enough to get another shaft in here sometimes. Oh, I've got Omni Geo. Lucky enough, I suppose. Ah! I didn't know enemies could attack you in there. That's a bit of a shocker. Ooh, got a ghost. Ha! Hiya! Oh, we got a mummy as well with the looks of it. Ah, uh, it's the only thing with these. They got a fair bit of HP, but they get shot back straight away as well. Good timing. Oh, that was, ooh, that was as well for him. Haha. Ooh, what was your? Oh, we got a staircase anyway. Didn't notice that. Gonna say I can't make any more boom boom balls now anyway, so Oh got a dino If I can get a dino egg now I would be quite chuffed Ah that's a shame Right tell you what let's eat that cheese then so I got a prehistoric tibia, and I'm sure there's something else for you as well. Prehistoric vertebrae. Yeah, it's a... Gotta be more dinos here. Yeah. I got a fiddle head in, so I'm not too concerned with that. It's gotta be another dino here yeah, somewhere. It hasn't got to be, but it'd be nice. Oh, yeah, there's a few more, actually. Right, shoe fly, don't bother me. Oh, got an egg. Right, got to sacrifice something again. Oh, I've already got the gap. I got another tibia. Right. Awesome. Oh, we got the staircase as well. This has been a very good run so far, considering. Because I wasn't really prepared for this. 
So we can hatch that dino egg in a bit now. Oh. Right. So you don't want to risk anything at the minute now. in soon anyway so let's just grab what we can now ah nuts it's more already more at least Say stock up on the iron ore now more than anything. That's probably the most valuable thing I can see at the minute. Another Omni ge Geode wouldn't go amiss, but can't be given everything. Oh, hang on. Uh, I'm not gonna get that. That's a, I was just gonna say as well, that's a, one of them anyway. It's not a real one. There we are. I got two Iridium ore out of that anyway. That's not too bad. Level 7 combat, Thorn's Ring. That might have been one of the ones I was thinking about earlier, actually. And the Ring of Yuba. I'll have to double check to see what they do. Well, that wasn't a very... For the first run, the Skull Caverns of this playthrough, that wasn't a bad run at all. Got the Galaxy Sword. We had a treasure room. Alright, it was only a turban, but still. Morning, alright, how you doing? Right, so yeah, we had a quite a good run with that. In fairness. Alright, let's swap our caps over. Oh no, I don't want to throw it. I'll keep her. Right, let's put that away for a minute. Right, let's put our third back in the fridge for now. Let's begin three spicy eel at least. And there's a fair bit we can use here now. And I got a dinosaur egg. But I'm not going to give that the gun for straight away. Because I'm going to hatch that one. How's that vertical looking? Is it too zoomed in? Too zoomed out? Because I'm playing with how he's looking at the minute on the vertical. How's he looking? I see you've entered the Skull Cavern. Well done. I've got a better challenge for you, kid. Make it at least 25 levels deep, and I've got a mountain of gill to send if you can do it. Didn't I just do that? I'm sure I just did 25 levels. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty confident I did 25 levels on that run. Didn't look mine, so I could have done anything. That. Oh, got a fair bit of it out now. No. Gonna say, yeah, so I think I'll give a look at hatching this dino egg as soon as possible. I think I've got an egg in there now, though, at the minute. Which is not end of the world. Yeah, I've got an egg in there at the minute, so what I'm gonna do. Let's put these in for me and these in. I'll keep the dino egg in the cow barn for now. I know it's not accurate as such, but while I'm here then, I can get the pail. There we are. There we are, this one. And two. So I can't see any of the other animals at the minute. They've got to be here somewhere. Oh, there's one. Ah, oh, that'll do for now anyway. That'll do. this up there we are so I think that's gonna be the last now of the bok choy growing
grips. Here we are. What's up? Sell them to them because they're slightly higher grade. Let's see what we got from here. Yeah, mostly rubbish, but it cleans it up, doesn't it? Right. Touch. Yeah, so that wasn't a bad first run of the Skull Cavern for this playthrough anyway. That was really good, actually. Yeah, I can gift a lot of that. Here we are. Tell you what I'm going to start doing. Is I'll start bringing these sprinklers back up here. And organise that area then. Where I've got my crops at the minute. And condense it down more. Because if I can start doing winter forageable seeds then. Due to the winter. That'll help with my money ready for the new year. Oh, maple syrup. I have to. Oh. Yeah, because I think it's when you see crow bus, isn't it? You get the magnifying glass for secret tips. Ooh, got lots here. That better not be a pomegranate. Now we get a pomegranate after we just bought one the other day. It's absolutely typical. Despicable. Right, speaking of despicable, let's get rid of this rock. Make the access here a bit better. There we are. Right, I'll go grab that in a bit. Right. Oh, I'll tell you, I mean, I could probably preserve jar a lot of that. Just to make a bit more money out of it. I may as well do that for now. Yeah, I think gold star stuff upwards I think I'll keep. I don't want to be keeping every single thing, I don't suppose. So I need to make some money in the meantime as well. So, let's sell that. That can definitely go. I'll gift these. I mean, because you need to start getting a friendship up with people because I'm a bit of an introvert, even in games. Right. So we've got to sort this farm out a bit, I think, at some point. Ready for the winter. It's a shame you can't use the hoe to also undo your work. Because you can probably cover a bit more of a footprint with that, but it is what it is. Right. I mean, they may actually... Oh, eggplant. Right. Right, I'm not going to get anything out of these now, so... May as well stomp them out. Right, that's fine. I mean, I'll give these till tomorrow now, just in case they flourish. But in the meantime... Give this a look. I think the first thing I'm going to do then is upgrade the watering can. And then I'll upgrade this hole to the iron one. Right. Oh. No, nope, wrong way. Yeah, because I can put it like another two rows bigger then, if anything. Make it a bit more productive then. Be better use of the space then. But anyway. Let's get some light on the situation, is it? Ah, oh, that's for all my tools as well. The other bits, where are they? Ah ha 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 ha, there they are. Ah, that needs to go out, actually. I'll keep that one as a spare, actually, for now. Yeah, so, let's go to the community centre. 
And do the wall, and I think that's the final item for that then. I think that'll unlock the greenhouse then, I think, for us. Oh, hello, Abigail. How are you? Finally beat the first level of the journey of the Priory King. Watch a new play helped a lot. Right, well, for that, have some cheese. People love cheese. I do, anyway. Right. Ah, oh, The blinking festival, innit? So I can't do nothing today. I thought she was going to go on the bus, then. But can I still go to the community centre from here? No, I can't. Oh, and I've sort of caught Linus having a bath. Whoops. I don't think I've seen this cutscene either. The water's never been cleaner. Ah, oh, it's because I did the... I did his task the other day for getting the rubbish out. So hopefully I can go see the... I heard you visited Calico Des Desert recently. How fascinating. I'm sure you observed many unique life forms on your trip. Have some honey. Right. Oh, we might be able to get to the community centre then. Because I... Ah, oh, no, actually, no, can't, can we? Because of this bit. Yeah. Ah, oh, what a dire shame that is. Yeah, i got to wait for that then. Right, what's the next barn upgrade cost then? I'd probably rather do that first. But then it's only here for the sake of it. Yeah, I think I'd rather do the stable first, if I'm honest. So if I can get 10, pardon me, if I can get 10k. I think I'd rather do that first, if I'm honest. Right, right. add some of this. No problem. Right, well there's not much I can do now until 10pm. Really? Because I think it's the um, night festival. Oh, that's a thought. I need to get a number for that mermaid singing thing, don't I? This is a great gift. Thank you. Yeah, there's not much for me to do at the minute now until that 10pm mark. I'll tell you what, I'll get some forageables, get some money in. I'll tell you what I could do, actually. I could start getting some of the hay ready for the winter to fill up my silos to make sure sure I get through to the winter. That might be a good idea, actually. Whilst gathering forageables. Yeah, so I'll just do a bit of... I think I'll just lose them. I was keeping on the farm, I think, until 10pm. Probably the best I can do at the minute now. So I don't want to be ripping up all the crops just in case they're ready tomorrow. Right. So yeah, let's just get our scythe out and start getting some hay out. Ready for winter. Let's just see what we got. I think we got about the 400 mark. We got capacity for the 700 mark. Yeah, so we got a fair bit we can collect in fairness. So that should clear a lot of the farm out. In fairness, so I'll keep that one in there now for another day. Right. I mean, I'm saying I'm going to keep that blue grass. I mean, it doesn't make a difference. I can't access it. There we are. That's a bit there. Oh, there's a stone from earlier then. Yeah, so if I just clear this section and just check on it. Oh, there we are. Right. There 
the art as I've been done. There's the art, right. So, that should be more than enough now, I would have thought for that. And it's killed some time as well. Right, yeah, because I got a patch with it anyway, so it's not the end of the world. Let's see what we got. Because ideally a fourth one would have gone down quite nice just to make it even. Oh, crikey. i got loads of room. I thought it would be much more than that by now. In fairness. Obviously not. Right. Let's crack on then. So I haven't got to worry about the coop. Because that's got the auto feeder. But I gotta make sure I keep the cow's foot silage topped up. That's the only thing now. And worst case, we've got a fair bit of fibre in this playthrough so far. Whether it was a tweak that was made in the update or whether I've just been that lucky. I'll get this where we are. Oh no, this is the Halloween one, isn't it? Just realised it's not the winter festival yet, is it? It's the Halloween festival. The golden pumpkin, so we can get a put gold pumpkin today as well. Right, let's chop our down because I'm having a bit of trouble getting through that. Give that new, new bit of tree a chance to grow up then. Right. I still haven't figured out what moss is for yet, I don't think. I haven't found a use for it yet. I mean, I'm gathering it because they say at some point I'm going to find out. And I'm going to want to use it, so... Oh, mystery box. Spirit's Eve has begun in the town square. There we are. All right, I'll just do this row. Let's just square it off. Marvellous. And if there, then perhaps I'll finish it off. Oh, we've got another one as well. Oh, baby. Oh, look at the baby. Now look at the big baby. <laughs> right, uh, right, I digest. Right, so let's just check our silage now, see what we got. Oh, there we are, we maxed out on that now, that's absolutely fine then. I'm not too worried about that now then, if that's the case. Tell you what, we can put some... We can put some discreet light in here as well, which I know that sounds a little bit obscure, saying discreet light in, but... Gives it a bit of an ambiance, if I do say so myself. Ah, I'll put that there for now. That can go over there. Just to use them up more than anything. There we are, we'll have that open flame right next to the tree. It should be fine. Right, where are we here? Let's get rid of some of this. And then we make our way to the Spirit Eve. If I actually get it on time, because I've just realised what the time was. Whoops. Didn't think I'd be that long. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, Honest, my timekeeping in this game is terrible. Honestly, it is. Well, I'm here. Honestly, my timekeeping is terrible. Right, right, I think it's this one. Don't do though. Oh, yeah, it is. There we are. So we should have the greenhouse tomorrow then. Cheese press. 
Cheese, Gromit. Cheese. There we are. Happy days. When we're done here, we return to the other world. Marvellous. So all we need now are the winter forageables for you. And, that's, and even then, there's only two of them. Because I managed to find these two in the mines. So all we need now are these two. So hopefully we'll have everything done within year one, which for me is quite a nice change because it normally takes about a year and a half. So I, always str I either struggle with the fish or struggle with the things like the pomegranate and the truffles and stuff because it takes so much money to get them, obviously get them to the barn upgraded and then it's buying the animal then and it's having the animal long enough then to produce the items you need. But I mean, I still haven't been playing. I haven't been playing this game as, as long as half of anyone who's been playing it. So I'm still learning it technically. I'm still learning now. So, but so up to now, this is probably my best playthrough so far. I probably don't. I mean, realistically though, I think it's because on yesterday's stream, because I was struggling to save up for the barn upgrade to get truffles for Gus's bundle. And I also needed a pomegranate as well for the wizard's bundle. I went to the travelling cart lady on a Friday. There we are, it's our greenhouse coming up now. A raccoon. Yeah, so I went to her on, the, on a Friday and she happened to have both the truffle and the pomegranate. And I had enough money for both of them. So I think it's purely because of that is the only reason then I pushed on for saving enough money for Calico Desert is why I'm now in the Skull Caverns this early. They normally get into the Skull Caverns within the first month of the first second year. <laughs> Mitchell loves you. Ah, oh, bless him. Right, what's the TV say? Ooh, Queen of Sauce. Greetings and desire the Queen of Sauce. Artichoke dip. You learned how to cook artichoke dip. Can I... I, I don't have any artichokes, so that's probably why I can't cook it. Yeah, there's not much I can cook, is it really? Right, speaking of which. Oh, there we are, we're going to start harvesting everything now and ripping it out. There we are, so I can start doing a bit of pruning on you now. Now I know stuff is done growing. Right. Amazing. Let's get this sorted in. Yeah, so what I want to do is try and condense all these sprinklers down now into one big, more usable space. So when I start getting the iridium sprinklers, then it'll be easier to adapt it. Then I'm hoping, anyway. Yeah, because I mean, there's not much usable land for crop growing on this level, on this terrain. But this is a nice little patch for you in Venus, and south where the animals are being kept at the minute. So it's not too bad at the moment. There we are. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, that's why. Huh. There we are. Right, round these up. Round him up a minute, and turn the head. a bit wrong. Oh, bad. Can't believe I misjudged the time for that Spirits Eve festival. Tamping. I always lose track of time. Like I did just then. Getting distracted with stuff. Right, this one row. How many more sprinklers have I got? So I can technically can do two more rows. I might have enough. Oh, I thought I thought he fell asleep, man. Three, two, another. Well, oh, Siri's talking to me now. What's the matter? No, never mind. 
two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, because I've only got two beer now, so ideally I need to expand. Or really, I need to shift it over to. One, two, three. Ah, uh, mind you, the well would have been in the way anyway. Although I could, have pro I could probably move that, actually. I'm not going to worry about that too much. If I'm honest, there's no point worrying about that. Right. Okay, so last row now. And I mean, I'll let Sweet Corn wither on his own accord now, tomorrow when winter all of a sudden appears. Okay, ooh. There we are. One, two, three, two, three. There we are. So we got a fair bit, but then we can crack on with hopefully with winter seeds in the winter. Right. Let's see who sent us mail. You did it. I'm very impressed. Enjoy your reward. Ten thousand G. Oh yeah, I thought I'd done. 25 levels in the Skull Cavern the first time in the first run then. Oh, it's not bad, 10G. Right, I'll keep all of them for gifts. Let's fill up Nietzsche's bowl. Right, got two of my preserves done. So let's put the peach. Peaches, 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 peaches. Right, that can go in, and that can go in. Right, let's get our security up. Turn your bed view then. Head to security. Oh, there he is. Hello, niches. Right, oh, overshot that. Right, so it was about. I'm trying to make this symmetrical ish. One by there. I do need another one beer attack. I'm leave a. I'm not too concerned at the moment. But I want to see a bit more of this if I can. I would like to see my scarecrow. If that's not at all a problem. And we've got a lot of young sapling trees here as well, so they want a chance to grow, so you can utilise the wood from these fully grown ones to allow the young ones to grow more. It's starting to feel exhausted. I know the feeling. Right. Right. To say hello to the animals, sort out the produce. Ah, my inventory's full, that's a surprise. Oh, well, speaking of which, I'm sure I can... As I thought, Key has just given us 10G, haven't he? I could get that bag upgrade, you know. I've been dying for that for the ages. I've been gagging for that upgrade for a while. But everything else keeps getting in the way. Right. Tell you what. 100 hardwood, was it? Oh, I haven't got 100 hardwood anyway, so that's out of the question. I've got to do a bit of hunting on that in the meantime, then. So I'm definitely going to go get that bag upgrade, then. I'm sorry to say. But you only need about 2,100 anyway, call it. Not even that. To save up another 10, save up for the next one anyway, so... That should come easy enough. An invasive crab species are living in the local mine, threatening the native wildlife. These creatures are known for disgusting themselves. Oh, disguising themselves. Ugh. Disguising themselves as stones. I'll pay someone to slay two of them. I don't. Whether I'll get a chance, I don't know. Oh, come on, Caroline. Be reasonable. There we are. Huzzah! And that's the latest I've ever gone without that bag. That's the latest. In fairness. 
So what, is there anything he could sell now before? No. Speaking of which, there we are. Right. So let's get the Clint before he shuts, because I think he shuts at four. Oh, am I gonna make? Am I gonna make that now? That's a that's the trick. I don't think I am, am I? I no, I should be alright. Thinking about it. Then we we'll get a gun to then. Hopefully, we'll have enough then for him to give us the key for the sewer. Right, ooh, we got six Omni Geodes. What will we open? Okay, fire quartz. Not the strongest of starts, but it's a start. Five gold, that's not too bad. That's terrible. That's not too bad, that's alright. Coal's always handy. It's then very underestimated, and five stone. Okay, that's terrible. Never mind. But let's see what the mystery box gives us. I think the less said is better, I think. Never mind. But the thing is, I don't even know what the hope for, for their mystery box is. I don't even know what can what they can contain. So Right, so we've got Arrowhead. Got a bone. Ooh, new reward. And oh that's gonna be the dino skeleton parts, isn't it? If anything. Yeah. Well, now we know these can be set up in the museum. I wonder... Nah, that's not quite right, is it? You see, that looks a bit healthier, doesn't it? That looks a bit better. Right. Dun, ka, dun, dun. Doesn't seem like you have anything. Right. Yeah, because I don't think he offers you the key until at least winter year one, does he? When you meet Krobus for the first time. So I'm not too concerned. Mind you, if I just go to the mines a minute. Uh, I got nothing to give the door. Oh, I might do. Would he, would he like a fire quartz? I don't know. I doubt it. Could they just lay lying on the ground? Oh, I can't speak to him yet, can I? I haven't got the fourth scroll. Right. I would say I'll go hunt some of them rock crabs for Demetrius, but I haven't got much energy at the minute, so... I'm just going to take a quick dip in the baths. Get my energy recouping. I might just carry on tidying up the farm for this day now, because it's going to be the start of winter tomorrow, so... We can see what we can discover there. Da -da -da. We can see what it takes to make them rings as well, then. Hi, Mohammed. Right, there you get on, bud? So I just noticed the screen below now. Yeah, that energy sink up. That's our energy recouped. Bear with me a sec, chat. Just gotta send this message off. There we are. Right. 
just helping my sister out with a minute with a bit of advice here and there. Right. I mean, not much I'm going to achieve now in about four hours of gameplay. Of in-game time at least anyway, so... Get the vine. Yeah, it's typical. If I just shifted that over two, I could fit the I could fit like a sixth row here then. Or oh, unless I can get this well moved. If I can move it up here or something out of the way, because I don't really need it anymore now. So I don't use it that much. Right, I'll keep hold of that. I mean there's no arm keeping them mixed seeds for now, is it? Because I'm wondering whether they grow in the winter. I can't imagine they do, if I'm honest. Right, keep that in there then. I'll put the sprinklers away for now then, because I need a third anyway if I'm going to make it. I mean, I'm happy with that for a minute. We can put the cheese press in the cow barn in a bit now. Yeah, one, two, not duck egg, okay. I'd be worried if there was a rabbit egg. Very worried if there was. Hopefully that chicken egg won't take too long and I'll hatch that dino egg. The greenhouse, I forgot about the greenhouse. I can't remember if I actually milked the cows or not. Oh, you know what? This might be easier to do this in the night. Because they're all here. I mean, it's a bit rude waking them up. Fondling their udders like, but... That's a bit easier. Because they're all there, like. Right. Now we got the greenhouse. Let's get his access a bit easier, then. What I might do as well quickly if I get time is make obviously get some of this wood now. Make some fences and wrap it around those mushroom trees. So I wanna see if I can keep them until next season. So I'm a bit of a klutz. Cause I accidentally chop them down in the winter because I forget what they are. And then I go on a bit of a cleaning purge. Oh, I need to get a heat up for the chickens as well, don't I? I'll have to get that. To... Oh. I'm assuming Marnie's going to be there. Oh no, she probably won't be. She doesn't work half a day, does she? Half a time, does she? Right, get rid of these. Yeah, so I think the first thing I'm going to do... Is upgrade the watering can, I think. That needs sorting soon. Especially when we get to Ginger Island. This is handy if that is upgraded. It's getting late, okay. What I might do then, due to the winter, is expand. Right, get, get it eventually. Is expand the fencing then to incorporate the greenhouse, giving a bit more room for the animal then. So you've got access to a bit more silage. Right, so this is what I'm going to be doing to make sure. I don't. 
I'm gonna need a bit more than that. I'm not really sure I got enough room. So we don't disturb his growth. Oh, but I may as well wrap it around the both of them at this point then. Oh no, 2am. Damn, never mind. I missed that. Never mind. And day one of winter, year one. Happy days, right. Let's crack on with this then. Oh, we've got Squid Fest. Let's see if we remember this one, this event then, because I forgot about the trout derby at the start of it. Winter, a time where the world goes quiet. Now it's a great time to do some mining, fishing and gathering. Upgrade your tools in preparation for the productive spring, or get your local carpenter to build something on your farm. Stock up in resources, upgrade and prepare for the next year. Marvellous. Right. Yeah. Oh, wow. Right, Katamari. From what I can tell, you've been taking really good care of your pet. I'm really happy about that, but there are many sweet animals that need a home. If you're interested, I'll start offering pet adoption at my shop. Just be aware that there is a licensing fee. And also that each pet will want their own outdoor pet bowl area, or else they'll be unhappy. Robin will be happy to construct additional pet bowls for a price. See you soon. Oh, well, now that most of the thing is gone, I may as well... As dull as it is, I may as well start again. See if it means I can get that extra row in. I still need to make one more sprinkler anyway. But nonetheless. That's why I like doing it as I go along when I do the bigger ones, I guess, because I all get awful confused. There we are. There we are. One, two, three. No, that's all right. I'll get it eventually, Chad. I'll get it eventually. Just do it like this first off.
that's worked out ideal actually. So when I get the actual, when I get the third one now, I can just plonk her in the bed beer. Yeah, when I get the third sprinkler later on now, which won't be that long. I can plonk another row in then. It'll take a while of course because I gotta get the winter seeds up and running. So let's close the barn doors. And I gotta get a heater for the chickens, haven't I? I can't imagine they'll be too happy in the cold. off a bit actually just in case anyway, I'll leave it like half an hour that's not too vital I've got to drop this cheese press off as well there we are I mean they haven't got a third cow yet but I have to figure that out actually because there is a way of making them give birth, isn't it? I'm sure there's a way. I'll have to try and find that out actually. I don't think I've actually made them do that yet. Reproduce. That's what Monday. So we need to get the two forageables that we need the snow yam and the crocus. And then that's the community centre complete then. Yeah, she's not here, it's typical. Yeah, I want to get, want to get a heat there for the chickens, if anything. Daft as it sounds. Right, we've got the crocus. We just need a snow yam now. I think you... I don't think you've got to dig for them. But I think you need... I think you can dig for them. Or they are just here lying on the ground. So let's have a bit of a wander. Now, what hats have we got at the moment? Oh, I've got a good old cap. Yeah, nothing new. Right, yeah, so we're looking for the snow yam now, and then that will be the community centre absolutely 100% complete. Squirrel! Another crocus. Well, I'm going to get all the forageables now. In the hope that I can start making winter seeds. To keep the money up. i going to see where am I with my achievements. Oh, I'm not far off getting nine in fishing and farming. Well, that's a good effort. I mean, it won't be long until I'm level 10 in the fishing. Because I'll probably do it a bit more fishing to make the money up. Right, so obviously it'll have to be Marnie's tomorrow now. Oh well mind you she does parties tomorrow. So Wednesday I can get a heater for the chickens. If they haven't revolted and gone on strike by then. Right, 
Right, so let's have a look up here for the jibbles. Thought I could dig, but there, obviously not. Right. Sometimes you can find the snow yams digging the ground, can't you? So I'm pretty sure you can, anyway. Ah, oh, got a winter root. Not what we're looking for, though. Wonder if it was that one I was thinking of, then, and not the wind, not the snowy am. I wonder. Possibly that. Right. Hopefully, a snowy am around here somewhere then. So I'm not gonna bother going to the community center now until I got the both of them. No real. I know I'm passing it, but. Oh, that's a shame. I can't seem to find it. Unless it doesn't turn up on day one of winter, perhaps. I could all. That could be all it is. Let's go into this. Oh, hang on. Cutscene. Ding, ding, ding. The only thing with these old Xbox controllers, that stick is used so much, it wears down and it all grits off. It's the only thing with it. I probably need to change this one for a hardened one. Hello, Swell. Come join me. Care to join me, rather. Let me just go ahead and tell you what's on my mind. I have terrible luck with women, so... I'm a nice guy if you get to know me, I swear. <laughs> He's like, what? Girls all seem to like you, Swell. <laughs> Do they? Impress women with your strength and charm. Act crazy to keep your guess in. Just act natural, be yourself. Treat women the same as men. Just act like the, the thing you'll attract the one that likes you at. I do act natural, but I never have any success. Hup, oh, never mind. Oh, they're all in the winter clothing as well. I didn't notice, huh? That's the biggest change, isn't it? One of the, one of the one of the biggest changes. Yes. <laughs> Here's your beverage. <laughs> Here's your chicken stories. Oh yeah, because he gets the blue chickens, doesn't he? he? He manages to give you the blue chickens. I haven't managed that yet. I haven't got around to it, like. I'm doomed. Need a little warm me up to be ready for another cold night on the ocean. Yep, I'm back on the saddle, kid. Feels nice. case if anything no snow yam might be at the entrance beer for the bus there might be one hiding by there that's all we can hope for at the minute now winter route 
Hold a melon seeds. Oh, that's a new one. By Lux. Yeah, nothing I can see this time round. This is what I wanted to look at. Yeah, because there is one of these rings that like gives you the benefit of the glowstone ring. And it buffs your attack up. At the same time, I can't think what it's called. But I mean, that's probably not a bad choice on his own right. So I might actually have to look at making that one. And make the glowstone ring then. Keep that. Sell these for a minute. Right. Shame we couldn't find it on the first night. On the first day, rather, but... We'll have another look tomorrow now. Oh, what's going on? An explosion was heard in the night. Oh, what happened then? You know, a new item I'm carrying is called the wood chipper. You can use it to break hardwood into several pieces of regular wood. And no wood can be hard to come by in the winter, so if your supply gets low, consider picking one up. You can catch me a squid. You can fish for them in the ocean at night. They only show up in the winter, though. Okay. Fill it up. Give some water to my chairs. Not fair. Yeah, done. Say that chicken egg action can't be much longer, oh, surely. Yeah, get that. Tell you what, put the wool in there for now. So I don't want to use it for the sake of using it. I mean, I could probably sell it, get a bit of money, but. An explosion was heard in the night. Doesn't that sometimes mean a oh, one of them? Yeah, I thought it did. I don't think this is strong enough though. No. No, so that's a sign for me to upgrade my pickaxe then. Definitely before I do another skull cavern run, because it is a little bit limited. What well, you've only got. I mean, the steel pickaxe is alright in its own right, don't get me wrong. But I think you do need at least the gold one to make. Skull Cavern's a little bit easier. 9am. Oh, have a quick look for a snow yam. Nothing obvious. Right. All I need is a heater for my poor chickens and duck. Oh, come on, Manny. Can I just... Ordering pay you tomorrow or something. <sighs> Never mind. Tell you what, if I go back in. No, I don't think she's gonna do anything, I don't think. 
Let's have a look for this snowy arm anyway. I think while I'm here, I'm going to start having to collect hardwood as well, aren't I? Because I need hardwood for the neck, for the stable. Yeah, I'm probably... It's crocus, but there. I mean, we're collecting them as well, because I want to make winter seeds. To keep the money coming in. We've got one of them. Right, let's have a look at this then. I normally tend to hide. Not over there at the minute, obviously. Got the snow yam. Amazing. Amazing, so we can finish off the community centre then. Awesome. Right, let's get the hardwood from down here. Tried to attack me then. I didn't see it though. I heard it. I didn't see it though. Train is passing through Stardew Valley. Oh, but I haven't got time for that now. Not today, anyway. Elvish jewelry. Oh, well, Gunther can have that. Snow yam, and I got my crocus. Yeah, because that's the only two I need now. And one more sprinkler to finish that off. Iron and gold. So let's get that community centre finished off then. Oh, Krobus. Oh, but we've got to go by the way anyway, so that'll be fine. There we are, follow the footsteps. You caught me, I'm sorry. Take it, take it, take it. I, it looked so valuable, I couldn't help myself. Happy days. You've received the magnifying glass. You now have the ability to find secret notes. These notes reveal rare and useful information that can be reviewed in your collection tab. Meow. And now we go to the food centre. Where are we going to be finishing it? I think this is the quickest I've ever managed to do it on any playthrough. Personal land. Live like, so it's quite a, quite chuff to be honest. Okay, so we got the snow yam, and we got a lure crocus. Bundle complete, and that's the bridge repair then for the quarry. Winter seeds, happy days. That's great timing. That is, I can get those planted today then. 
the last bundle. Farewell, Swill. Awesome. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> June was a return to the spirit world. Marvellous. Blooming marvellous. Right, Gunter next. And I'll plant them seeds then. Ooh, notice board. I have an idea for a new style of pebble, I need 80 hardwood. Oh, I'm running a bit low on that a minute. The number of grubs in the local caves have made mining dangerous for other people, not me. It's good money for anyone willing to slay 50 of them. I could do that, actually. To get my combat level up and do that. That might not be a bad call, actually. Donate to the museum. Yeah, I mean, nothing much. Well, nothing at all, actually, but... Oh, yeah, we can't get to the quarry yet, can we? Because they haven't actually done it yet. That's fair enough. Let's make a start then. Right, so they're in the ground at least. Have I got any in storage actually? That's a thought. Don't think I'd have. Don't think I'd have done, but. I think I would. Tell you what, let's. Tell you what, I'm going to keep them in storage for next year, I think, actually. Because if I find any now during the playthrough, store them for next year, I think. Right, so there's our iron bar done. Anyway, let's get that watering can upgraded now. Yeah, because the holly isn't required. This winter rooted, so that's just snowy hams I'm lacking at the minute then. More than anything, to make more winter seeds. So the holly can go. And once the gold bar is done, then I'll have enough of the last sprinkler so I can put a, third, a sixth row here. And then I can just crack on starting then. That's got rid of it, isn't it? There we are. Yeah, so... Just waiting on that gold bar now. That should be done soon. And then I can make the last sprinkler then, and I'll get them in place ready. I won't bother with the ground in a minute. 50 grubs then. Uh, 
Right, Stardew Valley Grubs. All right, but how are you getting on? How are you getting on? Ooh. Yeah, we had a crack in running the skull caverns. In fairness, we had a crack in run. Got a dinosaur egg and everything. I'm waiting for my chicken eggs to be hatched so I can get a dinosaur. Aha! Right, so let's get that. Let's put these in place, ready, and, and we've actually completed the community centre now. I had the wool, the end of fall, and then we just found the snow we am now. So we managed to do, to do that as well then. Right, so that's our copper bar, ready for our watering can upgrade in the morning. So I'm going to start now getting gold bars ready to upgrade the pickaxe. Ah, nuts. Purely because skull carving is easier with the upgraded pick, in my opinion. Well, hopefully once this stream ends, it'll upload anyway, but I know what you mean. I started, I started quite early this morning, mind. I started at about quarter to ten, ten o'clock, my time. So I've been online already, about an hour and forty. In Venus. And I'm, I'm assuming you're about twelve hours-ish behind. Or no, ahead, rather, I know. You're about twelve ahead, I know, I think. No, no, you can't be. Right, no need to go over here. Right, let's just get to bed now so we can see all the community finished goodness. Linus is busy tomorrow, I don't want to miss that. Okay, Potato, how you doing? There we are, so the bridge is repaired. So we can get to the quarry in the morning now at least. Oh, he's seven hours ahead of you. Oh, so it's about 7 a.m. No, it's about 6 a.m. You were time then. No, 6 p.m. rather. Don't. Right, so it's laying as his birthday today, so I wouldn't mind giving him something. Cold slot. I already know that. Yeah, 6 p.m., yeah. Right, it's two of the gold bars done. done. Right. Hopefully this little chick will be hatched any day now. Ah, a new baby chick hatched. Motsu, there we are. I'll do. And we milk these cows first. There we are. One, two. Then we'll get our dino egg. Tell you what. Because I haven't got the autofill. Let's hatch this dinosaur egg again. So at least then we've got unlimited dinosaur eggs technically then. So then Gunther can have one. Until then he's not having squat. So snowy ham and the, and the other one and the crystal fruit. If I want to start making more seeds, yeah, keep out there a minute. If I come across a yam, then I can make some more seeds and crack on with that. Then let's see if any. Yeah, cause I'm just missing out on the snowy yams at the minute. I mean, with that, I. I went to the skull. I went to the Calico Desert. 
I forgot my prismatic shards, I went back to Stardew, sold stuff, and went back to Calico Desert with the, with the prismatic shard. And then I got over level 25 in Skull Caverns because Mr. Key gave me 10k for doing it, so can't go wrong. Didn't miss too much, I don't think. But we've obviously just completed the community centre now, so... That's sort of the long and short of it. Because the first time I've done this within the first year. I've always like managed to tail end it at the start of the second year of the community centre. So this is the quickest I've ever done it. I don't know how I did it either, but but the community centre has never looked better. You've done Pelican Town a great service. Everyone in town is pleased. As a way of saying thank you, I'd like to present you with this town's greatest honour, the Stardew Hero Award. You've earned it. There we are. Restore the Pelican Town Community Centre. Coffee's cold again. Come on, I'll just run a seventy five percent off sale and all my customers will come crawling back to me begging for forgiveness. You will see. Ooh, here we go. <sighs> yeah, there's but three in mine. That's the thing. Say there's one in every town, there's three in mine. But when I first moved to Pelican Town, this building was active and vibrant. We worked together to make the town a better place. There was a real sense of community. We used to do the crossword puzzle while sipping coffee in the community kitchen. for years. <laughs> so what makes Pelican Town special? When George Amart came to town we lost sight of that. Now thanks to Swill we have a second chance. I'm asking that you join me in boycotting Georgia Mart. We have the power to reclaim our old way of life. And open on a Wednesday! <laughs> Lived here too long to see this town go to ruin. You can count me in. Morrison is Joe Jamar cronies were never heard from again. Well, I wouldn't well, I wouldn't say they were cronies. I mean Shane worked for him technically, and Pam did I think. No. Yeah, I think Pam worked for him for a while, didn't she? I think. No, I might be wrong on that actually. Right, I like to put this trophy in the community centre. Personally. One that doesn't bang up my house or farm. And two, I feel this is where it deserves to be. So, speaking of deserving to be, I deserve to get this watering can upgraded now. So, whilst the gold bars get done. Try to keep the arrow fishing alive. Two pike. I'll probably forget, but I'll confirm it anyway. Ah, it's Linus's birthday as well today, isn't it? So we need to give him some cheese. To make him like me. Upgrade tools. Thanks, I'll get started on this as soon as I can. It should be ready in a couple of days. Right. 
So that's what I was looking at. I need to find, need to find Linus. And I need to know what level the grubs are on as well, because I want to do the I want to beat up some grubs. 15 to 29. That should be simple enough. Especially for our galaxy sword. Right, so Linus, I think, is now residing in the in the public baths. How the lost library book? The library has been expanded. Ooh. Oh, I need to get a void mayonnaise, don't I? I need to get a void egg. Ah, swell, I'll be waiting for you. Have I ever told you I used to be married? Strange, I know, for a man like me, but it's true. My wife and I were together for many years until until I made a mistake that drove her away. You are little Caroline. I'm not going to mention it though. Her anger and envy were so intense that she turned green and began flying around the countryside, cursing everything in her path. <laughs> Sounds like the women in the valleys, beer. <laughs> when I found out, I sealed this passage to her home, fearing that an innocent villager might fall prey to her dark magic. It sort of looks like a chicken in a box, didn't it? The two little feet, but there. Hang on. Yeah, the two little feet beer looks like it's like a big chicken or like like big bird from Sesame Street or something and it's just in a box. But they didn't fear us. <laughs> but now it must be unsealed, for when we separated she took my magic ink. I need that magic ink back. I would do this myself, but I can't see her again. That's why I need your help. In order to unseal this passage, you'll need a dark talisman. Talk to Krubus in the sewer. He should know where to find one. But I haven't got the key for that yet, but so you'll have to wait on it. You'll have to hang on a minute, like. I'm counting on you. If you can retrieve my magic ink, I promise I'll make it worth your while. Now go. <laughs> ah, now Linus, I thought was normally you. Uh, in the winter, at least, anyway. Can I? Or will I? I can say strawberry. Of course I can. Strawberry. Don't know what the meaning of that is, but... Right, 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 right. Well, he might be in his tent, then. Yeah, they, ooh, there's Linus. You remember my birthday? Thank you, this is great. Yeah, I gotta make sure I get enough... I think I gotta get enough items for the museum. And or... I gotta wait until at least the winter for him to give me the key for the sewer. So... I'm hoping around about now... I'll hopefully get the key for the sewer, assuming I've got, I've given him enough items. So I'm not sure if it's an amount of items given to the museum, or if it's both that and you've got to have seen Krobus first. So I'm not sure if Krobus is the catalyst that allows him to give you the key for it. If that makes sense. Right, we've got another item I can use for that. So, Dark Talisman. Enter the sewer and crawl us with Dark Talisman. Well, let's go give that to Gunther quick. I'll go to the mines then. Level 15 to 29. Beat up some grubs. What am I going to make money in this town? Yeah. What to do for fun? That's a good question. Right. So let's go see... Gunter at the ooh, crystal fruit. I mean, I need snow yams if anything, but I right, do want the rusted spoon then. Fair enough. Fair enough, but fair enough. Right. I'll go to the quarry at some point. Not now. Right, 15 to 29 is where these grubs reside. 
So let's hope we find a fair few. How many do we need? 50. Crikey. Doesn't want much, does he? But then it's a good way of getting the bug meat as well, I suppose. One. Mind it, when they're this easy to beat up, and they come in this amount, probably won't take that long actually, as long as they keep coming like this. Ha, I missed bucks. Actually, you know what, this isn't going to take that long. I got 18 now, as long as they keep coming. Ah, uh, you know, I should really get some copper as well, keep that topped up. Very nice. Ooh, secret note. Mermaid Show, 15423. There we are. I'll just Google it later. I just love coming back to the Mines of the Galaxy sword. It just shows how much stronger this sword is compared to all the other swords you get up until now. It just, feel, it just feels overpowering, doesn't it? Because if you take about three or four attempts on them, normally, and then all of a sudden you can just one-hit them. Following us, isn't it? Aha! See if there's any grubs over here. Not quite. Uh, I think there's a staircase over here. Oh, there is now, anyway. It's Sam's holiday shopping list, everyone's favourite. Ah, oh, we can get that one now. What's that now? The galaxy sword? Galaxy sword you get when you go to Calico Desert with a prismatic shard. If you hold it up as if you're doing that with it, if you take it between them three pillars, then on the top right, it turns into the galaxy sword, and that prismatic shard does. So you're using up a prismatic shard, but it turns into the galaxy sword. It was well worth it. So that's the thing when you start a playthrough. Ah, oh, i When you start a playthrough, if you find one, don't give it to Gunther straight away. Use it for the Galaxy Sword. That's what I would say to do. But yeah, on my stream, it'll if you it's like within the first half hour of the stream, I did that anyway. Even though I did fluff it up a bit, because so I went to Calico Desert without the Prismatic Shard, so I went back to get it. But yeah, just bring the Prismatic Shard. Because, like, on the top right, there's, like, three pillars. Don't know why I did that for. Then just show it to that, then. And it'll turn into a galaxy sword. I'll probably make a short of it in a bit anyway after this. So, even if you don't see the stream, you might catch the short. Because, like, little out tools like that, I'm trying to just get a bit more exposure more than anything. Right, 
so. My dear Granjal, by the time you find this note, I expect you would have been living in the valley for quite some time. I hope things are going well. I'm honoured that you're continuing the family tradition of farming, and through that noble endeavour, bringing greater life for a, an abundance to Wall of Stardew Valley. A place very dear to my heart, keep up the good work. Grandpa. P.S. I've hidden a very special secret for you somewhere in the valley. You might think of it as a compendium of my greatest discoveries. Some day when you're ready, you'll find it. I won't have a clue what that is. I don't think I've ever found that note before. I don't think. I tell you what, get rid of them. Get rid of that. I borrowed a necklace from Mum, but she lost it somewhere near the bathhouse. She's going to freak out if she notices missing. Ah, that's all right, man. I mean, I'll be honest, my encoding isn't the quickest on this, to be honest. I mean, it's just my internet connection is probably not the greatest either. I mean, in the well, we're in the middle of nowhere, like, so we haven't got the greatest speeds. I mean, the PC is not too half bad. I kind of regret my GPU choice, though, but i got to live with it. I can't really afford it. I can't. I'm not going to change it for the sake of changing it now. It'd be point. It'd be a pointless exercise now. Twelve more. Should be able to do that. Should be being the keyword. Right. Nothing here. Grub there. Not many though. Hmm. This is where it starts getting a bit panicky now because I don't want the day to run out for the sake of like 11. Oh, there'll be out of three there. Here we are. There. Over there. Can't be that many left now. It's a page from M. Jasper's book. The creatures known by some of the forest spirits of Juminos are said to appear in abandoned buildings that they've gone to seed. The general rule when humans leave and nature begins to reclaim their territory, the Junimals will undoubtedly appear. Folk wisdom holds that the Junimals display some kind of affinity with gemstones that are placed inside their little hats. Also, it's said that raisins are their favourite food, but they are too shy to take them directly from the hand. Of course, all these claims come from dubious and verified sources. As far as I know, even the mere existence of the creatures has never been proven. Tidy. Another five more. That's doable as long as they turn up. <laughs> That's the long and short of it. One. Only three more grubs, I think. Oh, I don't want to be coming back here tomorrow for three grubs. I think I'll be. Oh, yes. I don't need 
you do anyway. Yes! Happy days. Oh, I'm going to take this. Marvellous. Bus stop. Yeah, it could be, I suppose. I suppose it depends on you at end as well, I suppose. It's, uh, I suppose it's a bit of everything though, isn't it? I suppose, I mean... It's what it is, I guess. But it's like, my uploads aren't the best. Alright, let's get this sorted. It's like, I'm not sure why you were in internet collections, like, where you were. But like mine, I'm lucky to get... 40 to 50 megabytes per second. I'm lucky to get that. I'm mass assuming is like early morning like it is now for me. That's the only reason I'm getting this sort of speed is because of that. Right, I'll sell them right shoot, I don't really want them. And I didn't realise I had so many gold bars. Right. I'm gonna nip downstairs quick to get a cup of coffee because I am gasping. I'll leave that on our little intro. Thing a minute. I'll be back now in a minute. Bear with me.
helps them turn the microphone on, doesn't it? <laughs> right. As I was saying, right, we are back. Hello, Queen. How are we doing? How are you doing, lovely? How's the iron getting on? Oh, now, and how are you, more importantly? Right, so. Nothing of significance happening today. Welcome to the Living Off the Land. We're back at another trip for y'all. Listen up. Your hands are a fine course. Well, I don't know. Old quartz. I didn't know there was an old quartz. I've already I've been getting my refined quartz on pairs of old broken glasses. Oh, look at her, bless. Oh, I love her with a little hat, with a little shawl. Christ reminds me of my granny. No, it still does. She still wears like she still dresses like that. What am I on about? She still does bless her. Myths of summer, the colds of winter, always wrapped up like little old bitches. Going to the shop, now am I. It was a lovely walk out here. I haven't seen this old farm in a long time. It looks even better than I remember. Here, I brought you a little something. It's a gift from one of the garden to another. Marvellous. I've never really utilised these to the best of the ability, mind. I, ne I can never get them to work. These pots are really handy. You can use them to grow crops of any season indoors. They also look nice outside. But out here, they can only house in-season crops. Oh, of course I am. Ha! Bloody hell, I'll, I'll get this eventually. This is why you were in charge, Queen. This is why you're in charge. Yeah, this is why you were in charge. If you need more, they're really easy to make too. Here, I've got an old magazine clipping with instructions. Yeah, I love her, as I was just saying, looks like, it still looks like my gran. She still dresses like that to this day, 84, bless her. She's about four foot odd. I guess she is. Like, ah. Going to the shops, how am I? You need more. They're really easy to make too. Here, I've got an old magazine clipping with instructions. Learn how to craft garden pot. I need to look into that a bit more because I've never really... I tried using them once. And it just didn't seem to work. But I better go with George S. Grumpy if he doesn't have his oatmeal on time. You have a great day. Right. PA's general store is now open seven days a week. Oh, you heard me then. Thanks for helping me clear out those monsters. I'm not scared at all, but it should make the mines a bit safer for everyone else. Take this blueprint. Hope it doesn't make me obsolete. Geode Crusher. The close of instructions you to pick my favourite fish recipe. Fish taco. I've unlocked the back room of the shop. Come by when you have a chance. There's something I want to show you. Oh, that's for the, um... Oh, my watering can's in. Oh, you gave me some bone fragments. Bless him. Oh, that's nice of him. I hope the wound is. Be a bit painful otherwise. Right, let's put some of this stuff away. I'll flog some of that. Gunther doesn't want my rusted spoon. So he, so I can sell that. I'll sell that. I'm going to have to do some gifting today to get rid of some of these jellies, I think. Or jams, rather. I need to find some snow yams so I can make some more winter seeds. So I've got six per day, but it feels awkward planting just six. But you know what? If they're not in the ground, they're not productive, are they? So... Right, they'll have to wait for water because I haven't got any. Right. We've got to get a heater for the chickens today as well, haven't we? Because they're freezing their little beaks off, bless them. Because we have, because Marnie is shutting on Monday Tuesday, isn't she? Pretty much. I've got a little chick for there. And we've got a dino egg hatching as well, hopefully. Get them in. Right, 
Right, right, right. Right. Come on in, Musafa. Marvellous. There we are. Right. Get a peeler in. Oh, cow. <laughs> right. So I haven't even got an ancient seed yet. Normally I got an ancient seed by now. Even if it's in the mines. But I haven't even got that yet. Which is a bit of a shame because I was hoping I could have started ancient fruit in. I could, I suppose, start... Star fruit in. In the greenhouse, mind. It's a good point, actually. Wonder if I can get the keys for the sewer. Ah, but then he hasn't given me the keys yet, so. Yeah, I think what I was saying earlier with Pamela, if you wanted to get to the bus stop a bit quicker, if you just do this, she'll have a question mark. But there. And then she'll just start zipping across. So that can make her get to the bus stop a bit quicker. If you ever wanted to get to Calico Desert a little... Because if you do it from the start of her journey, from her trailer, then do it again on the next bit of the land over there. She gets it for about half past nine. She can do. I'm sure it was. And well, it damn sight quicker than she does anyway. Right, speaking of which, let's go give some gifts out. I have to look for some snowy arms at the same time, man. Need seaweed for a burrito. Right. Give this to Pierre. Here's Caroline, yeah. Oh no. Abigail's not there. Oh, there she is. Marvellous. Yes, we are. Tea leaves. I to show you this. It's my private sun room. There we are. That's the only correct answer there, really, I'd imagine. Please, where I can always find peace. Marvellous. I love to come here for a fresh cup of tea every day. My little ritual. When I'm alone with relaxing tea. I do enjoy these cutscenes, not gonna lie. The marshmallow monkey man comes out of it. <laughs> Don't remember that bit. Hope that makes sense. I can be pretty hectic, so having a hobby like this is nice. Feel free to come here and relax anytime you want, okay? Marvellous. Right. Oh, never mind. I thought he, I thought he gave you a tea leaf straight away. I thought. Never mind. Right. Let's go give, give in then. Where's Alex? Not in there. Oh. Is that the mayor? Nope. Let's go through his bins then. Oh, talking. Right. I can't remember what the Shamonka said it was going to be next. 
Ah, book of love. That's what it is. Friendship 101. <laughs> I could do with reading that. <laughs> You've learned a new power. You become friends with people a little faster. Oh, you become friends a little faster. Ah, that can't hurt. Right. Let's have a look at the museum now, because we met Crowbus now. Wonder if he does give us the key. Oh no, I think the cutscene is in the sewer, doesn't it? Isn't it? Right, no one in here, so. But you can't befriend Gunther for some reason. Doesn't matter, you. Soggy newspaper. The rock. And I think one of my favourite things in this 1.6. Is even though he's upgrading my watering can, you can still process geodes with him. That's got to be the best, best thing so far. It's got to be. Pile of mud. I know it's crystals. They're not exciting. I got a feeling I might need that one though. I got a feeling. That's not bad. Can always do with them. Right. I, no, I don't know, no, actually, I feel I've already given it to him. Yeah, never mind. I'll tell you what, then. Let's go up the quarry, then. I haven't done the quarry yet since doing it. Hiya, Gazi. All right, how are you getting on? All right, let's get to the quarry, then. Because we've got a fair bit here to do, though, because of it. Yeah, well, hopefully, we get some interesting bits in here, then. I remember once I seen like a swirly type of stone. Like that, but there now. And I think I had a prismatic shard out of it. That's not like one of my personal playthroughs that was. Oh, they're cool. Well, that's the first I've ever seen that. Right. Two, three, four. Uh, gold ore. Never mind. We'll go for another prismatic shard, if I'm honest, but... There we are. Yeah, what I might do to... Ooh, secret note. I hid something behind the community centre. Right, we'll go look for that in a bit. I think what I might do... Is I might do another run in the Skull Caverns. After all this, then. Obviously... Go to bed. But get the maison place ready for that. I don't need my watering can for the skull caverns or anything, so... Oh, mind you, I could go get the upgraded scythe, couldn't I? That's not going to be the worst idea, actually. Tell you what... It's me... Breaking up all this rock like a peasant. Just do this. A bit of a misjudge, but there then. Yeah, that's a lot easier. Twelve o'clock, sharp last day of the season. Check the bush above the playground. Right, let me get to do it all over again. Yeah, it's so much easier. I'm all for efficiency. Blowing it up makes it more efficient. 
Oh, I forget everything. I'll forget that. And that's on the last day as well, of all things. So if I do forget, then i got to wait all month again. And by then I'll forget. Right, let's eat some cheese. Let's just wrap around this. Right. Let's go get this golden side then. Yeah, I don't blame you, but I don't blame you. It's so much easier. This has changed, I think. I literally screamed when I first seen that. When I first played this game. I literally screamed. There's a flying skull chasing it. That's the stuff of nightmares. There we are. And they're not terribly hard to defeat. They're just awkward because they kick back so much. Yeah, you say little, the noise it makes and the fact that he just wasn't expecting it. It reminds, oh, tell you what it reminds me of, is the, I don't think it's the overworld sprite, but like when you're in caves and dungeons and stuff in Tales of Symphonia, I think one of the enemy sprites looked like that. It reminded me of that. I mean, that's not so scary because it's on the ground at least. This, this thing is flying. Come on. So however however little the skull is, the fact that it's flying, going am 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 at it with red eyes, it, come on, it's quite scary. Yeah, this has been changed. Thought it looked a little bit different. So I don't remember there being this bit beer. Your pickaxe isn't strong enough to break this. Oh, what a chip. I'm behind the paywall. I've got to pay Clint to upgrade it. Never mind. Ah, my inventory's full. That's a marvellous. There we are. Golden save. You've received the golden save. And then we can go back. Marvellous. So that's the golden save obtained. Marvellous, right, I'll take a little bit of a walk if I see any snow yams then. Ah, my inventory's full, isn't it? Um, I'll tell you what, I'll get rid of the soggy newspaper. I mean, it is soggy for a reason, I suppose. I'll eat that. Ah, what I wonder, what's a sip of that? Yeah, if I see any snow yams at least then. That seems to be my biggest flaw at the minute, is getting the snow yams. I mean, I've got 30 seeds in the ground so far. From the community centre, when I've done the bundle for the winter foraging. So I've got some seeds already, so I should be able to catch up at least. But I'd rather, try, I'd rather keep on top of it, because I want to get the cash flow in. They need to get hardwood as well. So I want to get a stable this year as well. That's a good point actually. I want to get a stable this year. But before this year ends. In the game, not 2024. Yeah, because I think it's this bush. I think, isn't it? Oh, and there's something behind the community centre. Not that i got room for it. But I've forgotten what it is. I think, oh, it's a Juno, Juno plush or something, isn't it? No, he lied. I'll find it later. It's, it could be because my infantry's full. In fairness. I 
done that. Right. Here we are, let's give give. Yeah, I thought you did. It's so smooth when I hold it. I can feel the energy of the mermaid of the sea. Thank you. Right. Gunter, you can have some mayonnaise, but Sorry, but That's all I got for you, really. I gave all my cheese away. Right. It's getting late. Oh yeah. Right, let's just quickly check for some snow yams up here. Nah, nothing. Right. Nothing to sell really, because I should really be keeping this stuff. For making friends. Oh, hang on. He doesn't want that. And he doesn't want that. And the and the diamonds and stuff. And all the mineral stones. Are good for the trade seller in Calico Desert. So I don't want to be particularly be getting shot of them. Because they are useful. Speaking of that. I wanted to go there tomorrow, didn't I? No, I got stuff in the fridge, haven't I? Yeah, so that and that. Tell you all then what I'll do. I think I should have some cheese ready in the barn. I'll take that with me then. Yink. There we are. Ooh, level eight mining. Mega bomb. Or mega boom boom ball, I should probably be saying. Because some people are sensitive. Progress has been saved. Right, so. Flip the letter over for instruction on how to make a super healthy meal. I was stopped by the sun room yesterday. I usually drink tea alone, but it was fun to share with you. I've been close instruction on how to prepare and grow your own tea. No pressure, but if you do the end growing up some, they should bring me a cup. Marvellous. I conducted a field study the other day and I found this specimen. Who we find it interesting? Very interesting. Oh, hang on, actually. It just said ancient then. Does that mean Gunther wants it? I don't think he does, but you know what? I'll keep hold of that just in case. Because I got a feeling Gunther may want that. No, no, it's a forageable. He wouldn't want that. Surely. Any snow yams? Nope. Right. I'm open. Normally, Pamela gets there for about the 10 o'clock mark. I'm open. if I stand by her trailer straight away, I want to see how quickly she does actually get there. Wiggles. Yeah, not terribly exciting. Yeah, because yeah, because if we can get it to shoot off there a bit quicker, we get an extra half hour in 
I think it worked out by the time I was outside when I did it before. When I thought about doing it. I think it worked out that by the time I got outside the Skull Cavern, it was about 10am. So you are saving about half hour, 45 minutes worth of in-game time with doing this little trick. But let's just wait for it to get out first. Yeah, we've just got to wait for it to get out now. Come on, Pamela. Aha, right. So if we do this, it was 8 30, well, 8 30 a.m. There we are, so she'll zip off now. I mean, we're still a bit faster than her, but... But I mean, what I'll do is I won't go to the next screen. Do it again then, because she'll slow back down. And then she'll do it again. So there we are. I mean, about about half hour in regards to game time. Which can make all the difference. Because that extra half hour can mean the difference between getting down an extra level or two and getting a treasure level or, or not getting it at all. Right, what I might do... One more time Sandy shuts. I'll tell you what, I'll do it another time if I have to. So I haven't got any ancient seed at the moment, so I think the best thing would be to get star fruit seeds, but <laughs> the beach. I mean And this is new as well. I don't know what that means yet. Right. And I forgot bombs. Or boom boom balls, I should say. I probably should take a bit more care of what I do say as well. It might get flagged up one day. And it'd be sad if it does. I don't mean any harm, but innocent mistakes and wasn't it. Looked semi professional doing that then. Or the YouTube. Yeah, I mean, well, I'm not sure because I noticed some streamers tend to curb what they say in a way. So it's like, well, I don't know whether they, it's the case that they can't be used. It's like, I suppose I should probably avoid using them because it may get picked up in some sort of algorithm, I'm assuming. So I have been meaning to write a few things down that I probably shouldn't say. I mean, it might be a case of only if people report it because I said it. But it's like, even though it's part of the game that I'm playing, it's in context. So it may get picked up in the wrong way, like, if, that's what it, if, it, if that makes sense. So I do try and avoid saying it, if I can, because I'm still learning all this stuff. But it's like, it may get taken out. It may get taken out of context. Then that's probably what I should be saying. Ooh, got a shaft. What do we reckon? I reckon seven levels down. I reckon. I I need a notepad to remind me to get the notepad, mate. I promise you. Three levels. Oh, okay, not not too bad. It could be better. Open for about open for a bit more than that. Tell you what, can I make any yet? I can make some small ones. I can make a small one. Yeah. 
Ooh, Omni Geode. Big flying ship and dragon thing. Ooh, that'd be handy. Ah, they're too spaced apart to use that one, so I'll do these ones manually. Right? Ooh, there we are, right. We have three levels on the last one. I mean, I'm not sure whether I'm accurate saying that, but I noticed some YouTubers, when they are either recording or whether they're doing live streams, one of them says something like that. And like another streamer then sort of like auto corrects this in, but in game, in game sort of thing, like saying you wanted to uh, someone, what they mean in the game, but the, another colleague then sort of reminds them saying, oh, in game, in game. So whether it's like an algorithm thing that picks it up, that's what I'm trying to teach myself now to be a little bit more aware of what I'm saying, even though I'm doing it in context, like in this game, I'm doing it within context. I'm still trying to teach myself. To curb it a little bit to try and either reword it or just not say it but we have three levels on the last hall i reckon six i reckon number six what do we think oh another three okay so two three so we well we've just skipped six levels at least anyway right Tall pass, I think that is. Yeah. Tell you what, let's see what's around the corner. Oh, we've got a ruby there, see? I don't want to miss that. Right. We've got the invincible bug. So I, I can't touch them for a minute. I still don't even know how, mind. I think it's something to do with Ginger Island, I think. We've got to use the volcano, we've got to use the forge, I think. But I'll be honest, I've never got as far as even learning how to use that yet. There we are. So I... Ooh, there we are. Woohoo. Right, if I destroy that one... Nice. Oh, we've got Omni Geode as well. Right. we got a really angry looking serpent there, so I'm. Oh, we've got my beer as well, mind. At least this one's giving it a go. Oh. I'm sure I get another one. Yeah, I thought I did. Aha. Aha! There we are. Oh, let's get the gold. Doo -doo -doo. I hear it. Don't see it yet. Ah, right. Wonder if, uh, I can make a couple more. Oh, I can make some of them as well. Mm, not as many as as open. Okay, well, let's just use that a minute. Oh, my fault. I wasn't paying attention. Maybe I can get at least one treasure level. I'm hoping. Whether I'll be successful, I don't know. Okay, oh, let me out. <laughs> right, so. 
We let him come over here a bit. There we are. I found some good things by looking in the garbage cans on lucky days. Sometimes you'll find the dish of the day behind the saloon, usually fresh. For dessert, I'll check the Molinas can for cookies. For treasure, I'll check by the cans by the blacksmith and museum. There we are. There we are. Let's get the ruby first, though. Right. Three. Yeah, but this is what I mean. I was saying earlier about upgrading the pickaxe and everything. For the skull caverns, personally, you need at least a gold, in my opinion, to make it so you can get through here quicker. There we are. Oh, we got a shaft as well. Let's just check down here. Nothing there. Right, so we've had two threes so far. Three and a three skip. I'm going to hold tight and say six again. Jump in. Seven. That's not bad. I think the most I've ever had on one is... 13 or something like that. Double prizes. Right, I know where our escape is now, so let's just see if there's anything of interest. I can't not look now. I've got this far. Uh, there's just enemies everywhere, so I'm not gonna worry about that now. I mean, I could probably find another shaft, but I'd rather take that for the moment. For the minute. I'll have to look into that one. I don't know. I'm not familiar with that one. Cheese is like. Yeah. Bit messy, but we did it. Oh, got a rabbit's foot as well. Nice. Oh, well, I'll see if the Georgia employee still buy his pickup truck by the shop then. Because if you give him a rabbit's foot, he gives you a night time to help boost your luck up permanently. We've got another one. Ho oh, ho! It is a lucky day. I mean, feel sad for those poor bunny rabbits, but nine. Nice. See, them rocks are a bit too spread out to justify using one of them on it, like, because it's all spread out. If they're more condensed. I'd probably do it. Amazing. Yes, I think before, I think on the Saturday before fall ended, I think I managed to get a fur, so I managed to finish that bundle. And then straight away then, it was winter two days after, hence how then I managed to finish the bundle. So I managed to find a snow yam from some of the wiggles. There we are. So yeah, so I managed to finish that then because of the fur more than anything came in. Came in a bit quicker than I thought to be honest, I didn't think it'd be that quick, the fur. It's like I knew I'd be able to finish the winter one, winter bundle, because I just had to wait for winter. But it was waiting for the rabbit fur was my only concern then. Ooh, I'm the geode. 
Right. Oh, there they are. Okay, I've got it. Oh, mining monthly. You've learned a few things about mining. Danger will rob us in danger. Right, run away. Nice. Oh, and a secret note. Vast calico desert. So, got a secret up there then. Oh, that's a thing then, obviously. Marvellous. Oh, my man winners. Oh, I haven't got any, okay. What I had. I've got a staircase at least. Yeah, so bombs don't even beat them up then. I think it's to do with the forge on. Ginger Island, I think. Oh, that was so close. I was going to say, I wouldn't want to get this far now and, fa and get defeated by the enemy. Oh, we've got a mystery box as well. Oh, that would have been tamping if I got defeated by there then. So close to the 2am mark as well. That would have been tamping. Hi, hey, Bavin, are okay? How you doing? Sorry, I just managed to look over. Right. Right, I don't... No, that might be a real one, because it's in line with that, because sometimes it's slightly off the quiff, isn't it? But I lied. I legit thought that was a legit one, then. Got crab cakes. Right. Oh, there we are. Iridium bar. Well, I really fancy that iridium bar. So I'll have that. The algae can go away. Oh, okay. Oh, battery. Oh, there we are. Alright, I mean, I was hoping I would get a treasure level, but obviously not this time, obviously. But a watering can is ready, though. Mighty exciting. Got a new girl, can you give a secret? I want to deliver an amethyst to Emily. Her favorite stuff. Okay. New journal entry, yeah, okay. Right. Tell you what, first things first. Let's deposit what food I haven't eaten in the fridge. So we've obtained crab cakes at least. Well, that's not a bad. Bad buff in fairness. Right, so let's deposit what we got. Oh, 
place. Right, so if I put that in there, put that in there, pick that back up, that can come back up. I'll upgrade the pick next. So the next time we do that then, it'll be a bit easier. Tell you what. And if I get these ready, if I do find a snowy arm on my journey, then I can make at least another pack of seeds. And an amethyst for the Emily. There we are. Yeah, I got a feeling I've got this one. But I'd rather check. Rather check with Gunther, if I'm honest. Right. Oh, I've got to get a heat up for the chickens as well. But they're frozen, bless them. There we are. One round of eggs done. See, that's why I like keeping the hay topped up fully. Because that's two days worth now, so it wasn't so bad. Well, I don't see what the benefit of this heater is then, because the chickens and duck and rabbit doesn't seem too disheartened. I mean, obviously I'm gonna get it. But they don't seem too discontent with it, like. Ah, oh, but I may as well put that in there for now. Right, before I forget. Yeah, I've barricaded my mushroom trees off as well. Because I've always got a bad habit in the winter thinking, oh, what's this? And then after I've chopped it down, I realise then, oh, no, it was my mushroom tree. So I just want to see if they survive the winter and grow again, basically. So I've barricaded it off for now, so I remember not to chop them down. Oh, oh we've got Wiggles there. I'm just hoping for a snow yam, if I'm honest, at this moment, no? No. Oh, let's check the back cave while we're here as well. Ooh, many fruit. Right, so let's go to Marnie's and buy a heater for the chickens and duck and rabbit. Heater, there we are. Dun, 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 dun. There we are. Give some to Marnie as well. Ah, give it an egg. Nope, no mind. Thought I thought you wouldn't mind that. Obviously she does. Bless a little art. Right. So, if Emily's in here, we can give her the amethyst now. I'm assuming she is. It's still early. Aha! Favourite stone, you're so sweet. Got it a cleanse. Well, I don't care where you got it from. It's beautiful. Thank you. Smooch. Now you have less work to do in the winter. What is it? Do I need to give it anything at the minute? Oh, technically, yeah. There we are. There's one for Haley. See if I uh, didn't really do anything, but can we go in here now? Man? No, still locked. That must be a further on event, perhaps. Or perhaps you don't get to go in there at all. I'm assuming it's a developing room because she's into a photography, isn't she? I 
Right, there's something I only found out recently, is if you come across here, I'm not sure if it'll be there now, because I normally do this before I do the community centre, I think. In this truck for you. Yeah, he's not there. Normally there's a guy in here, and he asks for a rabbit's foot. And if you give him the rabbit's foot then... Oh, so I'll have to look into that then. Yeah, because if you give him, the ra uh, give him a rabbit's foot then... He gives you like a charm that helps you... Gives you a charm that helps your overall luck. I'm trying to think... Which one is it? Oh, I'm not sure if it's by there actually, but... I think it comes up be on the bottom here. I think. Yeah, hang on. Yeah, I think it comes up here, I think. Is it gonna like a little luck symbol then? But obviously I've done it before going to him. Unless he's not there yet until this gets opened up again, perhaps. So I'm not sure how you get that now. Now that I've done it before doing it. It's a shame, I'll have to look into that. Anything to give to you, Mia? Maybe he has a copper watering can. Upgrade tools. Golden axe. Ah, oh, I didn't want to do the axe. Ah, oh, bugger. I'll teach you for Russian. Oh well. Got one of them. And got one of them. I know. <laughs> so the mystery box gave us two more boxes. Got a warp totem. And another warp totem. The beach of the farm. They're not too bad. They're more useful than I give them credit for in Venus. But I just keep forgetting to bring them when I need them. That's the only problem then. Donate the museum. Oh, two new items. New reward. Nothing for that. The totems, they, depending on which one you get, is like warp directly to your house, consumed on use. And you go different ones then, you got the beach then, you got the woods, and you got like, you can get one for the Caracol Desert then, you can get one for the Ginger Island then. Tell you what, collect rewards. That and that. Tell you what, let's just set these up here in a minute. Because I don't particularly want them in my house. Tell you what, I'll show you now. So if you use the one for the house, it does this then. There we are. Then you get warp back to your warp to, your, to the warp point for the farm then. So they are more handy than I give them credit for in Venus. I just gotta save up more money now to get enough money for the pickaxe. Right, let's put the heat uh, about there out of the way. Right, but I gotta start all this again then. In regards to making money. It's a thought. So I'm assuming they can get pregnant already then, I'm assuming. Just I haven't had the luck of it yet then. Yeah, I love that scene. I haven't seen that for ages, actually. That's given me the itch to watch that now. I mean, for the time it was made as well, definitely. Because I forget how old it is. Right, what can I flog off here? Yep, yep. Ah, he obviously didn't want that then. 
Yeah, so I'm still looking for a snowy am then at the minute. Right, I think um Writer Boy likes that, I think, because he mentioned about a duck quill is a duck feather as good as a quill. So I might give that to him. To make friends. Okay, didn't mean to do that. I'm cool, cuss when I yeah, oh, got an egg, egg and flog as well. Right, 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 right. Du, du. Right, so, if we have a look, hopefully we'll come across a snowy ham at some point on our travels. I'm hoping. No. Oh, because sometimes the wiggles have them as well, don't they? I need to bring a proper thermal cup up here. Oh, oh, I need a shave as well. Keep it a bit rough on the edges. What? Glass? Well, good, I got that off the beach. Yes. Winter seeds, winter seeds. There's nothing like winter seeds in winter. Yeah, so we've got to save up another 10k now. The pickaxe. I was hoping to use a pickaxe and to get past our new rock in that cavern by the quarry. That ain't gonna happen. Right. Oh, he's not here. Okay. Is he in the pub at this time? I didn't think he was at this early. I thought he left about, left there about six, I thought. Ah, Saturday means we may have he may have started early. I don't think he's gonna be in the museum now. Huh. He's not here. Cause I mean there's no point selling that duck feather if I can give it to someone who'd appreciate it. There we are. Unless he is in the museum. Cause he sits in there sometimes, doesn't he? Tell you what, let's see if he is. Let's see if he is. There he is, man. Right, would you like this? This will make a beautiful quill. I feel inspired already. There we are. See, so no point wasting it, just selling it for the money. I'd rather give it to someone now to get the friendship levels up. I feel a bit good that I can't get into the sewer yet. It's a shame. Oh yeah, I gave her an egg, didn't I? She didn't like it. Let's get these seeds in the ground while we remember then. Of course, I can't water them now because I gave away my watering can. Oh no, I got it back. What am I on about? That's a start. See if that's done. Yeah, I've already done it, haven't I? Because I have. Oh, did I sell them? I 
Oh, but I've already done it then. Never mind. Okay, um... Yeah. Crack on with the next day for now then, I suppose. Oh, now that I've still got my pickaxe. Could do another skull cavern run. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, I'll do that, right. If I can go, that can go. If I can go, that can go. And then then. Right. So won't need that or that or that. Or that. I'll keep hold of the cheese. You never know. Gotta add them in there. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Do, do, do. Nothing by there. But I remember, do that. Oh, hang on, have I not got any. Yeah, there we are. I'm glad I remembered that. Get the cake, spicy and crab cakes. But what I want to do is... Last thing I want to do... Is use the warp totem by accident. Whilst I'm in the middle of having an epic run. So... Be sure. It's Caroline's birthday tomorrow, but... I'm sure she'll understand. I'm sure she will. Ooh! Hopefully then, that means we got a void chicken then. We could do with one of them. For the void mayonnaise. That's actually come and got quite good timing actually. That's actually really good timing actually. Oh, hello. So your first year in Saudi Valley is almost over. If you keep buying seeds from me, you'll be twice as productive next year. And I have some exciting news. I'll be selling new seed varieties in my shop next year. I should have one new variety per season. That's all I wanted to say. Have a good one. You know, I wouldn't even bother trying to make a better the seeds. PA seeds are the highest quality seeds you'll find anyway. That's a promise. Well, yours are the only seeds they can buy now, but so... Made a little treat this morning in the Morton Saloon digging. Oh, that's good timing, actually. Marnie's out for the Vessel of Ice. It's a celebration of winter. There'll be snowmen, ice sculptures, and an ice fishing competition. Between 9 and 2, if you'd like to participate. I think I will, actually. Right, tell you what. I'll try not to get too distracted. There we go. I'll just make sure the cows have got silage more than anything. Oh, and see if we got what the score is with our white chicken. We've got the void egg at least now, so. At least now I know I can crack on with doing that. The next. Once our dinosaur egg is hatched. I mean that's gonna be a while yet, I think. They do they do take a long a long time the Dino eggs, but worth it. So I think the mayonnaise goes for quite a fair bit then. I'm just gonna leave that totem by there now. I'll just try not. I'll just try not to hit it. That's why I don't like bringing the warp totems with me. If I'm honest, 
So I'm always a bit of a... I always tend to hit them by accident in the middle of a run. Whereas I mean to get food or something or swap out items. Right, let's see. Pamela leaves at about half past the hour, doesn't she? So let's do our zoomies one. About now ish. Come on, Pamela. Right, so we do this again. Maybe up. There we are, so that just makes it a bit quicker. It does get her there a bit quicker in the long run, because normally she gets there for like smack on 10 a.m. Whereas doing it this way, she'll get here for about half past nine mark. So it means it's only 30 minutes in game, like, but. Can make a difference. There we are. Amazing. This shit, we can't drive it ourselves, to be honest. We'll get an Uber. Ah, I forgot to bring any gemstones again now. Because I think he sells different stuff on a Sunday, I think. Doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah, see? Spicy eel for. Yeah. Ah, never mind. Ding, ding. Yeah, what I was saying about the galaxy sword earlier, if you bring a prismatic shard and hold it so it looks like that on your on yourself then, and you stand here, you get like a small cutscene then and you get given the galaxy sword then. I'll get rid of them. Craigie had an hammer in on the first level. I can't imagine what the rest is going to be like. My supplies already, but oh, what would you do? Oh, nice. Honestly, though, I'm hoping to find an ancient seed so I can start all that stuff in the greenhouse just to save me buying the star fruit. Right. Have it here. There we are. Ha. Ooh, nice. Right. I reckon five levels. Seven, nice. On the shield. There 
these in. Let's keep that health on top of that health. Ooh. I thought I was going to get caught out by that then. Magma geode. Destroys the boxes and doesn't break them in. Okay. I'll have to be cautious with that. I know if you're right, ah, thank you. I do enjoy Stardew Valley. I'm not gonna lie. I only discovered it back last year, if I'm honest, about September, October time. So I haven't been playing it that long compared to a lot of other people, but nonetheless, it's a brilliant game, considering. Right. Get rid of some of these. Tell you what, let's consume these just for recovering some of the energy. Not to waste the better ones for now. Right, so where are we at? Okay. Off. I wonder if I can lure him over here a little bit. Come on, mummy. I don't know how do you, how do you call a mummy? I, I mean, just wrap up some toilet paper or something. I don't know. Lure him down here a little bit. There we are. Marvellous. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it was a heck of a learning curve for me when I first started because I didn't realise about how to make the sprinklers and stuff like that at first. I just thought you had to like, make money and buy them. And then as soon as I realised about the crafting mechanic, it, I just went from there then, and it was brilliant from there then. It was brilliant anyway, So I enjoyed Harvest Moon back in the day, on the old Game, on the old game Boy Colour like. So I enjoyed that back then, but this is such more of an advancement compared to that. That's how this, well this is how Harvest Moon should have been, if that makes sense. Well, there's not many rocks here to blow up, so... I'm going to avoid that a minute. Tell you what, can I make any of the smaller ones? Can, so... I think I'll do that instead. But that, uh, I don't think that's close enough, actually. Oh, it was. Fair enough. So I don't want to waste... Ooh, two of these shields. We got the staircase, marvellous. Yeah, honestly, it was a simple enough game, but I yeah, I really enjoyed Harvest Moon. I played it to, I played it until absolute I went through well, I put it this way, I went through so many batteries playing that playing that game. I mean I also went through a load of batteries on the old Sega game gear, but that's because of the three hour battery life. <laughs> so that's why, pretty much. Right. 
Oh, got two beer, so. Ah, it's a bit of a waste, I think, but. Oh, we got the both, got the both of them, huh? Right, we got another escape. Let's just see what's up here quick. Oh, this might be worth a look. Come on. Let's get some food in us just in case. Come on. There we are. Come on. Right, I think, I'll, I think I'm considered safe a minute, but there now. Let's see the spaghetti we had from Gus. Oh, nice battery. Let's have a look at that. Oh, there we are. Happy days. I'm mostly hoping to farm the Omni Geodes now for some of the more of the artifacts because I'm hoping to get the key soon for the sewer. I think that's the next checklist thing at the minute now. All the while saving up money for the pickaxe upgrade because I accidentally hit the axe to upgrade and I figured it needs upgrading anyway. I'd just rather have upgraded the pick first. But nonetheless, but I'm hoping to get the key for the sewer soon so I can just by the soup, the iridium sprinklers. So I just find that a bit easier. And to progress with the story on that side for Crowbus as well. I'm not having much luck with finding the staircase at the minute though. Oh, got a secret note though. Waiting for you on level 100 in the Skull Cavern. Well, I can't see me doing that today. You didn't even make a noise, that's not fair. See, at least that one had the courtesy to make a noise to introduce himself. Even though he's not coming yet. Just have to be patient. Oh yeah, because I think I had the um the attachment for the Super Nintendo for the so you could put the Game Boy Color games or the Game Boy games to play them on the Super Nintendo on the TV then. So I did that, and I was mainly on Pokemon Red for that and Blue, but I had it for Harvest Moon as well. It just made it a bit easier. It's like I think I was saying on yesterday's stream. To Meshi that um I actually have done the Skull Cavern on my personal playthrough on the Switch without the use of the staircases. Of course I got no way of proving it. <laughs> I think I took a bit of a screenshot of the text that Mr. Key tells you. But that's all I got. But it's just a shame that some of my best gameplays have been on my private account. Always a shame, like. Oh, there we are. Right. Ooh, right. Tell you what. 
let's get some health recovered first. And energy, I suppose, at this point. Right, I reckon five, I reckon six levels. Jump in. Oh, spot on. Right. Too nice. Yeah. Oh. Huh, two staircases. assistance for that one. Oh, nice. There we are. Oh, I think I've... Ah! Yeah, I, as soon as I laid it, I realised I messed up by there then. Could have used it for beer, actually. attention Aha, there we are. Oh, nice, right. Wrap up here. Five levels, not too bad. Yeah, we would have got we haven't got long left now on this one. Shame we didn't get a treasure level, but I don't seem to have much luck with getting them. I got a feeling that's going to be a... Oh, never mind. We'll never know. We'll never know. Wondering whether that Iridium ore would have been a crab or not. Ooh. There was a strong windstorm during the night. Level 8 combat. Happy days. Explosive ammo and a slimy incubator. Strong wind during the night. Festival of ice. Marvellous. Find any tree seeds while chopping wood. You can grow those seeds in the ground and a new tree will grow. Get creative. Bargain. Right. Oh, I've got another rabbit's foot. And four cloth. Happy days. Right. Forgot to put the food in. Da -da -da. Marvellous. 
Right. A strong wind during the night. Okay, I don't think I've heard that one, but I don't think I've had that one before. So that's a new one on me. I think, anyway. I can't even think, I can't even recall what it is. Where's the rest of my stuff? What was the other one? Crystal fruit. Open if I find. Snow yam, I can keep on making winter seeds. So I'm running a bit behind on that at the minute. Only reason I got the 10 initially was because of the bundle, the winter bundle. Right, I don't want to be picking that void egg up yet. Because I'm only going to forget it. That's what I could do with another mayonnaise machine then. Now I'm expanding operations. So I gotta wait for this dino egg to hatch first. It's gonna be, take a long time yet. Amazing. Right. Let's get that topped up. Some new ideas to sleep on. I still don't understand what that means. I don't know whether I'm meant to be doing anything with that. Got 18 geodes, mind. How many geodes? So I'm hoping to have at least a couple of items new for the museum then. And hopefully then he'll give us the keys. The sewer. Dun, dun. Right, well, I, I can gift these. That's not so much of a concern. Yeah, go on. Nice for a change. Ah, missing the axe, and I, I thought there was something missing. Right. Sometimes there might be a yam up here. No. These yams are being very elusive this winter. The festival of ice has begun near Marnie's Ranch. And I meant to use the minecart. I'm too far gone now. We should have a hundred in skull caverns. I wish I could. I honestly wish I could. I'll never do it again now, because I've done it on my personal playthrough and that's about it. Oh, was it to do with this? No. I still can't believe this guy goes. Tamp him with that. Normally you can give, you can give him the rabbit's foot. He gives you a lucky charm then, of some sort. Ah, oh. oh, it's because of this festival, isn't it? Fair enough, right. Okay, let's have a quick look in the quarry. Nah, let it build up a bit more then, if that's the case. Town... No, I meant to do a bus stop. I knew that. Right. Got a man on his ranch in. Got this festival of ice done. We have a setup. Oh, there we are, right. I guess winter is an old bad pain in the snow can be fun. Gonna say I thought there was a shop here. Let's see what she got on offer. Yeah, I can't afford that. Wall scones. Wall scones is it? Cranberry sauce. 
Ah, oh, that's what I meant to keep pumpkins for, was to make the pumpkin soup. Ah, oh, nuts. I'll have to wait till next, you know. Well, how much are they? Ah, we got one anyway, fair enough. Oh, hang on. Do 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 do. <laughs> ah, it's alright, man. It's alright. <laughs> Sebastian gang. Well, I I are ready. Now, considering I love I love the fishing aspect of this game, I've never been very good at this one. and your goal is to catch as many fish as you possibly can in two minutes using the provided fishing rods. You can catch your first fish from these holes in the ice. So does that mean you can go to the river after that then? Because you've got to catch your first fish from the holes in the ice. So does that mean I can go to the river after that then? Doubt it. <laughs> Here we are. Ooh, come on. There we are. Shiver couldn't have just slipped some bait done. Give me the competitive edge. Ooh, here we are. I've got a perfect there at least. <laughs> Sebastian's a nerd. He is, I suppose. And he's probably going to be on Mega Bucks. He's a programmer, isn't he? In this game, like. There we are. Got a third. Come on. I got four so far. I'm not doing too bad. It just takes such a while to actually get a bite. It's the only thing. Come on, at least at least two more. I was gonna say, but I don't think that's gonna happen, is it? To get at least seven, but well, that's a lot of fish. <laughs> now, for the winner of this year's ice fishing competition, Willie, probably, or Pam, or Pam La. Ah, oh, happy days, I won. Here's your prize, enjoy. <sighs> I never use any of them. I probably should mind. Because I've never actually got around to actually catching the legendary fish at all in any of my playthroughs yet. So I should make this the playthrough to actually go and get them. If I'm honest. So maybe using them sort of ones would help. Well, time to head home. Right, well it's too late to do anything now, so... That's the only thing. One, two, I'm sure there's a third. Yeah. Right, well, the hat can go in the cupboard. Ah, oh, mine do. There we are. Captain Nitches. There we are. Right, the pumpkin can go in there. Root platter. Oh, three attack. 
Oh man, I have to look at that. Right, I'll do the setup tomorrow, I think. Right. Ah, we have got Sebastian's birthday on Wednesday, so someone will need to remind me. Level 10 farming. I think I'm going to go for the artisan one year, because with 40% uh, more as well, see? And I do do a lot of that now. Yeah, I can always change it later on. There we are. Your gold axe is ready. Not that I wanted to do the axe, I wanted to do the pickaxe. Oh, there we are. Right, so if I get the rest of my winter foragibles. So I got 60 at the minute now, so that should be a fair whack. Don't think I'll complete it all. But I'll bunch it all up. Bunch it up to there so far. Let's see where we are then. It's surprising how quickly they consume. Oh, I got another 17. Get in there. Got a water now. Okay, that be probably easier if I just do it like this for now. So. I think, I think I've covered. I got four spit. Oh, have I got any in the chip? No, I haven't. I used them, didn't I? Didn't want to use four. Right, let's check on the animals. as it wasn't hatched yet. That's fine. Here we Failing on snow yams again, even after all that. It's Tuesday, so any well, can't go to Barney's because she's shut. Because she's a lazy hoot. Well, we can go get our we can go get our axe that we didn't want to upgrade yet. We can go get that. Prehistoric skull. Where did you find that, boy? Wow. Oh, well, actually, Gunther might actually... I don't think I've actually got that one. So Gunther might like that, actually. I'll do all the geodes first. And I'll take a trip to there, then. And I keep walking to Clint's all the time. when I, I keep forgetting I've actually done the minecarts. I've done the community centre, even. I keep forgetting to utilise it. Get my steps in, I suppose, though. Get my steps in. Mm 
Le crocus. Ah, let's check the bin. Soggy newspaper. There we are, the golden axe that we didn't want, but we've got. I mean, it needed upgrading anyway, so... There we are, right. So, Magla Geode. Got one of them. I think we had that on the last one, the big site. Right. No. <laughs> Another one of them. That might be new. Clay. Ugh, crystal. Well, I can do that to get another mayonnaise maker, if anything. Because I got four egg producing things now, haven't I? So. I think I got that one. Ten gold, that's not too bad. Coconut cup. Another fire quartz. Another coconut cup. Blue rock, bit of copper, and more copper. Not terribly exciting, but nonetheless, hopefully, there's something very that interests Gunther at least. Donate the museum. Ah, just that then. So that's gonna be the front part of that skeleton, then, isn't it? Oh no, it's not. All right, it's a rare crow. Fair enough. Ah, fair enough. Right, but I got a fair bit to flog off then. A stop. Right, let's get rid of all these then. Actually, no, I think they've got a use sometimes, haven't they? Right, what do I need? Copper bar. Let's get a copper bar then. Fifteen wood, fifteen stone. Come on. I we did. Anything for the preserves? No. I'll tell you what, I can sort of whip those in the shipping bin now because they're worth a lot more money now and the mayonnaise can go now sort it I'd rather keep that for the my, my mine runs if I'm honest the cheese that is handy I know there's no perks for them sell that oh, I can put that in the preserve actually I'm not going to touch that void egg for now because I want that void egg to hatch into a void chicken. What do I need a void chicken though? I mean, I can just 
buy another void egg from Krobus when he decides to grace us with his presence. Hmm, that's a good point actually. Put into there. Right, plonk up of there. Plonk that up of there. I think I'm going to do another cheeky skull cavern run in the morning. So they can go up there. Got four cheeses now. Possibly six of the other ones are done. Because they can be that open for a minute. I've got an awful habit of keeping it closed. There we are. There we are. So I've got six cheeses at least now. What I should be doing though as well is actually going to the secret woods to get some hardwood because I need one to upgrade. I want to upgrade the horse as well. Well, to get the horse rather. I want to be doing that as well. So I should be making more of an effort to go to the secret wood. Bath? Oh, is that what that strong wind was in? The old tree is gone. However, with a hundred pieces of hardwood, this could be fixed up. It doesn't want much, does it? Right, let's get hardwood for that then. <laughs> oh, isn't that to do with the raccoons or something? Don't don't know how many raccoons end up living there or something. Or so I've heard. Oh, I got a lamp. Ideas to sleep on. Yeah, I've done that now, so that's fine. Organy seed. Probably do with actually plant in some more of them to get more hard with actually thinking about it. Oh, just seen the little bob over there then. Oh, under there. Marvellous. That's a thought. What do I need to make that glow string ring? Five iron bar. Them two rings might be worth doing, actually. Before I go into the Skull Cavern, that's going to be a while. I think I've already got some gold bars already. Yeah, I'm going to make those two rings, I think. Because the one glowstone ring acts as a magnet and illumination like this one does now. In one ring, and the other one then... I forgot what it does. Shields... Occasionally shields the wearer from damage, so that can only be good. In fairness, that can only be good. So let's have a. So we'll, there we are, we'll do that next then. So we'll do that now rather. So we do one at a time. Right, so five gold, iron, and a diamond. Right, there we are. I got the gold already. I have to remember the top of my map as well. Right, and let's plant this one. But there, out of the way so I forget about it more than anything.
There we are. Right. What are we here? How do we make furnaces? Can we make them a bit easier now? 20 stone, 25, so 40 copper. What was the other one? It was... So 50 stone. Quicker now more than anything because everything seems to be like multiples of fives for a lot of these crafting stuff, so it's a bit easier if I do that. So I'll grab a diamond ready now and then grab the five gold bars. What was the requirement for the other one then? I say multiples of five, that's two, it's typical, isn't it? Another five iron and five solar essence. There we are. Wait for this a minute. Well, I'll take my two rings off for the minute now while that gets done. But it'd be good if I actually took them off. There we are, that's that. dark by there so I thought I'd put some illumination on it but then again I could have just taken this one there I suppose because that's not proven to be any good anymore there was if I put it behind two in the bed happy days oh, I take it longer than I thought Oh, but then again, I've been pausing the screen half the time. That's probably not helping. Right. One, two, three. There we are. So, there's a ring of Yoba, which occasionally shields the wearer from damage. Ah, there we are. I'll get a glowstone one done first. So yeah, emits a constant light and also increases your radius for collecting items. So I think there's another upgrade to this one then, later on at level 10. Which is that, plus it adds 10% damage then. So, but for now, that is a nice little upgrade. There we are. We got, oh, we've got the under hardwood for that now, but I'd rather have the horse. If I'm honest. I know it sounds selfish. And the raccoons need a house, but I would rather have a horse. I think this is going to need to move as well, isn't it? Tell you what, while that gets, fin while that finishes off, let's move this across, ready for a stable. One, two. Three, four. May as well line it up properly, isn't it? Might forget that's there if I'm honest. If I leave it with it. So I can plonk it over there. One, two. Stashing these seeds. Stashing them there by the looks of it. Right, so just waiting for this now. And then we can make our other ring. And then we'll be ready for the skull cavern run in the morning. 
we're a little bit more prepared then. Because we've got a bit of a buff. There we are. That's that one. There we are. There we are. There we are. There's a ring of Yoba. There we are. Marvellous. Ah, leave it on the table, better bad. Let's get a pumpkin soup that that won it. Oh, let's get our... Ah, we haven't got any, have we? We used them all up, didn't we, I think? Yeah, we used... Oh, no, I don't. I got two left. Not out of the world. Right. Ooh, level 8 foraging. Survival burger, 10th kit, and a... Taught them for the farm. Ooh. Oh, there we are. Nice little boost on the cash for there. Right, there we are. Got a new item in stock. It's called the Auto Grabber. This Think of milk your cows and goats, shear your sheep, gather eggs and pluck your woolly rabbits. All on its own. It's considered a luxury item, so I'm charging 25G. Yeah. And that is like one of my favourite items in the game. Is the auto grabber, I'm not gonna lie. It is one of my favourites. Right. So if we plonk these then. I tell you what, I could probably... I'll tell you what, actually. There we are. There we are. Well, if I get the cow sorted out quick. Oh, no, I don't think he'll have enough time before 10 a.m., will I? I don't think it's that quick, is it? Yeah, one. Oh, she moved. <laughs> she moved. <laughs> right there, yeah. Put the paler in. Yeah, I'm wondering, could I just put that void egg into the mayonnaise anyway? Because you can get a void egg from Crowbus eventually anyway. And you need it for that, um, to get into the witch's house to get the ink for the wizard, don't know. But I can always buy a void egg later on. So I don't know whether to just, well, I won't do it now because I'm not going to have a chance to do it today because I'm going straight to the skull, skull cabin. But... Now we're kitted up with a bit of better gear. Right, so Pamela should be not far off by here. Here she is. Right, so if I stamp up here. Dot, dot, dot. Or question mark in this case. Here we are. Again, then. There we are. 
Right, let's see what luck we have this time then. First and fourth most. Let's see what I've forgotten to bring to get the trader. Ruby, yeah. Yeah, the ruby mainly for the spicy hill. I keep forgetting to bring. No worries, mate. Have a good one. Have a good one, bud. Have a good one. Hope to catch you again soon. Purple mushroom. That's always handy. Right, let's dive in a little bit deeper before I start hitting every single rock. Mm, this is not looking too hopeful at the minute. Ooh, secret note. I like the goss. Nighttime, that bush. Ah, oh, that's for the... Yeah, that's for the one that... That, isn't it? For Marnie and Mia Lewis. There we are. See if we can catch him in the act. I don't, just don't, know, I just don't know why they just don't go to Mayor Lewis's house. He's obviously living on his own. And Shane can look after the, her daughter anyway, or granddaughter, whoever she is. Right. See if it's not too exciting so far, is it? I mean, mind you, if it is a bit dull, that means there's no enemies, and if there's no enemies, it makes it a bit easier. But it's still a little bit too quiet. Oh, there we are. Ah, slime. Oh, I know. Aha! Aha! Ah, no, nah, there we are. I jinxed that, didn't I? There we are. I knew I shouldn't have said anything. Oh, why'd you pick it up for? Got a massive snake. Flying snake coming after you. The only other thing it needs now is legs. That would be scary. Aha. Maybe I'll get the copper. Oh, got a nice gaping orb here. Right, I reckon five level drop. I reckon. Let's jump in and find out. Three. Okay. There we are. Oh, hang on now. Two of them now. There we are. Not too much there, but 
Right. Oh. Need some cheese, it'll make everything better. Hadn't said nothing. That was all I mean. I didn't know that enemies attacked me. Here we are. I just realized though, we can probably get the pick upgraded now as soon as possible. Hiya, guys. Alright, are we all doing? Oh, we've been raiding them, eh? Happy days. Thanks, and I really appreciate that, mate. Oh, oh, hang on. There we are. Ah, damn, there we are. Right. Aha. Aha. Well, welcome all. My name is Swell, for all gate purposes. We're currently on Stardew Valley 1.6. And I'm hoping... Right, hang on. I better take this phone call as the boss. Apologies for that. When the wife calls, you've got to answer it. <laughs> Otherwise, she'll wonder why. Oh. Oh, you bum. There we are. Aha. There we are. Right, better eat some cheese. <laughs> oh, thanks, Murphy. Appreciate it. Oh, you work night as well, do you? Yeah, that's fine, mate. I appreciate that. I mean, I've done up to the community centre so far. Ooh, so far. But I don't think I've done too much of the 1.6 specific stuff. I don't think, anyway, but... Oh, my, oh, there is one or two little things that probably would be a bit of a spoiler now. So, obviously, just advise, advise on that. Got some new ideas. Ooh, staircase, finally. I mean, if I do just the skull, I'm doing mainly the skull caverns at the minute now because I'm in the winter. I've done the community centre now, so I'm not going to be doing too much specific stuff anyway. So it's just mainly all the skull cavern runs. I'm just trying to do skull cavern runs now. Ideally, trying to get to level 100, but I've not had much luck with that at the minute. And I haven't got any many jades either. I'm trying to do it without the use of the staircase, mind. Yeah, my daughter's got a rugby tonight. That was my partner reminding me of that fact. So, ooh, purple mist descends. Ooh, I wasn't expecting that. Aha! There we are. Ooh, come on. Oh, I don't know what's happened, but I'm flashing. Oh, that was so close. Oh, I don't know. Oh, is this the effect of one of my rings, I think, is it? Must be. Yeah, because I got the glowstone. Increase radius and light. Shields the wearer from damage. There we are, must be that then. Oh, no, my, my boss is my wife. My boss, then, is a work colleague, as far as I'm concerned. He's not my boss. He's just a work colleague with a bit of power. My boss is my wife. Always is. I do get a constant migraine from being under the thumb. <laughs> Aha! 
Alright, let's see what's in this box. Coal. Well, I got plenty of that, 20 feet above my house. So, I don't need much of that. Though it is handy in this game. Right. Ooh, marvellous. Right, I heard it. Wait for that, that was flying snake. Aha! Amazing. Ooh, and a spicy eel. Right. I was going to say, I want to look out for the shafts more than anything, but I'm not having much luck with that today. I should have checked my luck, mind. But I don't want to be coming here on just lucky days, because it's potentially days wasted. So I'm hoping to find ancient seed as well, if I'm honest. Oh, got emerald. Tell you what, let's destroy that. Ooh, omni -geode. Happy days. Right, let's have a gander down here. Uh, see, there's not enough stone to justify... Oh, where was the diamond? I missed that, didn't I? Didn't I? Must have. That's not it, is it? Surely. Ah, still. Oh, there he is. Haha. -ha. Thank you. Did I didn't notice that, I'll be honest. I honestly didn't notice that. Oh, and the geode. Oh, this is worth while then. Aha, definitely was. That's the thing, when the stone is basically scased out, like I not you can't justify using a circular boom boom ball. I'm trying I'm trying to curb what words I use as well. As I was saying earlier on the stream, I'm trying to curb what sort of words I use. Definitely. Definitely. You would notice it in general, like. I don't blame you either, they are pretty. Right, let's get that. Oh, run away. Oh, crikey. I'm fine, pan into the oven. Oh, that soup didn't last long. Hmm. Huh. Fair enough. Right. So, uh, so I mean, it's not really worth... They're so thinly spread out at the minute. That's the only issue. Come on. Ha! -ha. There we are. Multi. Oh, I'm, I'm trying to just task, let alone multi. Oh, purple mist. Yeah, sorry, and I'm not sure if you were earlier. I, I did. Yeah, thank you for the raid, mate. I appreciate that. I know I've never been subject to one before. I'll be honest. Right, do I really want to be? No, I don't. Not at the minute. Aha! Amazing. Yeah, I think. I think that's the thing. I think my vertical is on a different latency to my mainstream. I just, I'm not sure what to do for the best, to be honest. Whether to try and up the latency for the vertical or down the latency for the mainstream. Mm, could use a cheeky. Let's see how I get on now. Ooh, secret note. Let's be nosy. Ah. So I take it that's the character's grandmother then I take it. I'm assuming because obviously it's an old black and white photo to make it look like it was from the olden days. So with it being black and white then I'm assuming that's the grandpa and his wife because I'm assuming that's a lady and I'm assuming the child then is potentially your character's parent. That's my assumption or unless it's actually meant to be you. I don't know. What do we all think on that? I personally think that's meant to be the grandparent and you on the farm as a young baby or 
your parent as a young baby on the on the said farm. That's how I've interpreted it. Because you only ever hear of your parents through letter, you don't actually see them do. It's not as if they come. It's not as if they come actually at all to the farm at all, do they? Or any of the events. <laughs> Let's have a look at that again. Secret notes. Oh, hang on. Ooh. Which one would it have been? Ah, there we are. I have four, four doors. Oh, there we are. <clears throat> to me, it looks like it could be Marnie. Marnie's farm, actually. But to me, this because of the black and whiteness of the photo in the background, it tells me that there is meant to be an old photo. Because there aren't there rumours online that supposedly Marnie, when she was young, and your grandfather... No, hang on, no. No, that's your grandfather and Evelyn, wasn't it? I meant to say. It could be Marnie, then. Yeah, it could be just Marnie and Jazz then, thinking about it. That makes better sense. Because that is obviously her farm. But I would... Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. That is young, a younger Marnie and Abby. Or whatever her name is. Um, Jazz. That does make better sense, actually. I, I thought too much into that, I think. I thought too much into that. <laughs> Just reading comments, but they know. Yeah, I, I still haven't quite got the. Yeah, I think you're right. Actually, I think I think I was thinking too much into that with the whole theories and everything. It, I think it is just a younger Manny and Jazz. Ooh, it's getting late. Aha! Right. Thought I heard it. Ooh. Oh, I thought it was a prismatic shard then. It was a minor street. That's a shame. And I was just going to contemplate. I'm consuming a spicy eel, but I've just realised the time now is I'll be fainting soon anyway. There we are. I was hoping for a treasure level, but... <laughs> no, isn't it? It does. I, well, funny enough, I'm off to both call in a bit now. For My daughter's got a rugby match. So I'll probably see a lot of them minor streets on the on the seafront. No, no way, my luck. That's assuming they're open, yes. Ah, uh, one more for luck, if I can get out in time. Aha! Oh, I forgot about them boxes. Just get this tray, didn't I? Oh, hang on. Aha, there we are. It'd probably take a few weeks to send it all the way over there, but I could do. <laughs> no hassle. Oh, there I go. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, got a little line minding though. Oh, and the Crystallarium. Marvellous. Day 11. Oh, blinking. Harvey took build me, didn't he? So I'm 25 gil off upgrading my, my pickaxe. Oh, and I forgot Sebastian's birthday. Sorry, Queen. Squid Fest tomorrow then, right. Oh, well, I mean, I need to make... Adjustments anyway, yeah. Uh, right, okay. Put that in there. 
keep hold of that for now. That could be handy in there, actually. You're lucky I found you last night. You were unconscious. Someone was searching your pockets. Oh, I bet. Yeah, you, I bet. I have no idea how much money they took. They ran away as soon as I approached. I be more careful. Okay. That. That. Them. And that. So put that in there for safekeeping. Still haven't got a snowy arm yet. That's a bit of a pain. I've only got five geodes though, I thought I had more than that. I could have sworn I'd have had more than that by now. Never mind. Right, let's get the other stuff out. Yeah, that looks right. Tell you what, gold bars have we got as well. Yeah, I mean, they do do that. Yeah, you got there on Barry Island, as well, on Barry's Island as well then, but you both call sound more accurate. Yeah, because you got like you got the fun fair on your left, up a little bit, then it narrows down. You got like a lot of shops beer. You got the It's like an ice cream shop on the right then on his own. And you got the sea front then and then you got the arcade in front then. If I remember rightly. It's been I haven't been there since the last time, so I can't quite remember. What was I doing? That should be in the fridge actually. Just go off in the chest. <laughs> yeah, that I think I'll double check. I think it, I think they still do the seafood and cockles and stuff like that, yeah. Yeah, that sounds about right, actually. Yeah, it is in front of the fair now. Yeah, cause they, oh, yeah. I think they do a bit of the seafood, like the cockles and stuff like that, and they do a lot of ice cream as well. Then I'm trying to think of the name of it now. The famous-ish one in Wales. Can't think of the name of it. Oh, it'll come. It'll come to me now. Yeah, I think I'll do that void, uh, void egg later for the void mayonnaise, so I can get some. So I can go get the ink for the wizard. Right. Here we are. One. Two. Da -da -da. Marvellous. Right, let's go get these geodes sorted then. Hopefully we'll see some more snowy yams so we can make plant some seeds and make money. So at the moment we're running low on the yams. No, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to get some gold bars on the go so I can upgrade this pickaxe next before I go to the skull caverns again. Right, so I only need four then. 20 there. Right. Ah, there they are. wonder where I put them in. There we are. So they're obviously going to take a while now, so... Let's see, may as well... Put that for guidance. Definitely a guy grabbing some ice cream. My daughter would not forgive me if I did not get her ice cream. She would literally have not so much a tantrum, but she'd be like, "Well, where's the ice cream?" Because I think we got to go a bit earlier first, just to get her on the beach for half hour, an hour, because she'll want to go on the beach even in this weather. Oh, mind you saying that. Apparently, we're having a mini heat wave, 
So basically that means our rain's warm. That's all it means. Our rain will just be warm, that's all it's gonna mean. Yeah, so hopefully now get these geodes cracked open. Hopefully we'll have something again for the museum for Gunther. Hopefully we just get a key then for the sewer so we can get access to the sewer. That's all I'm looking at in the minute now. Process geodes. Itchy nose. That might be new. The petrified slime. Always handy for the mayo maker. Cold. 26. Oh, no, that's disgusting. <laughs> I'm sorry. I could not handle that. I mean, it's nice, don't get me wrong. But then, as they say, though, in Britain, it's like, oh, it's a different type of heat. I mean, it's obviously the humidity, in it? It's not the heat, I guess. It was the humidity, like, but... We just... We just ugh, nothing, nothing I have to donate. Yeah, that's all it is, end of the day. It's just the wind has just decided to change direction and you're just getting a different weather different weather pattern in, isn't it? Basically, yeah, that is all it is. I think that's all that's it. We got some sort of Spanish plume or something, I don't know. Well, we got something, well, it's nicer anyway, I mean. It's actually not, it's actually not raining for once. I, I don't think I can't, I can't remember the last time it wasn't raining. Honestly, can't. Yay, snowy amp. You can tell I'm getting old and getting excited for digital snowy amps. You can tell now, can't you? Oh, got some wiggles over there. I don't mind 16. I can cope with that. I'm not gonna lie, I can cope with that. And again, anything about 22 up. It's just no need, we don't we just don't need it like. Don't need it. We're not, we're not built for it. <laughs> Corn. Right. Oh no, I didn't upgrade it, right? It is a bit harsh because we we don't even know what the blue sky looks like half the time. It's, li well, it's literally it's sunny, right? But it's still full of clouds everywhere. So I just don't understand how the sun is managing to get past all our clouds. I honestly can't. Right, uh, let's give Lina some cheese. Mind you, get the crow gust just to keep on the seeds. Yeah, you're not, you're not far wrong. I don't mind the snow. It's just I'd rather it in the background. If I'm honest. <laughs> oh, Craig, you got plenty of wood here. Oh, hang on, I got a secret note for up here, haven't I? Yeah, but they thought they had. Treasure chest. So what do we do that then? Or do we give it to Gunther? Beans? Um <laughs> on on this one. You start off with two chickens and they name them for you, so they toast beans and toast. <laughs> so yeah, he found that quite funny if I'm honest. No worries, menace. Have a, I hope we have a good class this evening. Oh, Wiggles. Thank you for joining me, I appreciate it. 
Yeah, so the game automatically named them beans and toast. No, no one. I know, innit? And beans is actually the brown chicken as well. And the white one is actually toast. Like white bread in it as well. <laughs> I found it quite funny. Sell the chest for gold. Turn it into a pirate hat. Using the Emily's sewing machine. Or give it to someone because it's a universally loved gift. I'd rather have the money if I'm honest. Oh, Ooh, donate. Ah, the ruby. Oh, well, I got loads of rubies in the chest. Didn't help mine, but that's another thing, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, and it, the other thing you can add to that, beans and toast, is grated cheese. Right. Pierre's prime produce. Look for a quality of our high quality veg at the slightest premium. No, we need 25 gold star veg. Well, not at this time of year, but. 100 in a week and they'll earn a reward. Well, that looks, that sounds much easier and much more up by street. <laughs> yeah, I had cheese. Well, yeah. Well, on the diet I'm on at the minute, cheese is a pretty big one on it at the minute. I think it's like one of the only keto friendly foods I can have at the minute. Oh, hang on, I got a book. Didn't notice that. Ah. Oh, I must have already added then. Yeah, I'm going to sell that treasure chest then if it's money. Because I need a fair bit of it. <laughs> well, it's the right thing to have, isn't it? It is the right thing to have. Right, so... Well, it's loaded with treasure. That is sure to fetch a good price. Yeah, I hope it does. I genuinely hope he does, because I need it at the minute, because I want to get a horse. Add to existing. Add to existing. Right, I have done that, but... And a yam. Maybe that's another pack of seeds. Made that a bit easier now, I suppose. This is a case of just trying to make the most of all that now, I suppose. <laughs> well, a lot of places need to know, need to understand the awesomeness of it. It's, a, it's an underappreciated delicacy. Yeah, I'm going to do this void egg and then go get the Shamanka tomorrow, the ink for the wizard. So I think he's a bit lonely in that tower, down, tower of his. Well, the top add up, what I remember. A thousand wood? Oh, right, okay. I thought it said a hundred. I thought it sounded a bit too good to be true. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, to start here then. I could do with cleaning this out a bit anyway, because I've got a few sapling trees here that I need encouragement to grow anyway, so. Yeah. Well, that's it, because I've got a lot of sapling ones here, and they just can't grow because there's too many of the fully grown ones, so. And I need a thousand wood apparently, not a hundred. I thought it sounded a bit too easy. Compared to 25 gold vegetables in the midst of winter. Marvellous. 
Oh, this is the only thing that we just drags now. We're gonna. Oh, but then again, I'm getting through it quite well. Probably because I accidentally upgraded the axe instead of the pick. That's probably why. Oh, it does make it quicker, mind. There we are. Right, let's do it this side, make it a bit easier. I see all the seeds starting to grow soon anyway, so I won't have to worry about wood for too long. Won't have to worry about the trees grow. Ooh, misty box. Yeah, fair do. Hopefully, with energy pending, hopefully I can knock this out right now. I'm hoping. Because I always struggled with um, Linus' this task. Collecting 20, 20 or 25 bits of rubbish from the rivers and everything. I sort of discovered the other day. Oh, yeah, true. I got cheese, didn't I? I sort of discovered the other day then that if you just go to like either level 60 or level 100 of the mines, you fish a load of trash up there because you've only got like one fish in there, you know, either the gorse or the fire eel. So that's just what I've done. And I did that the other day on stream, and it was so much easier. So I always used to go in the rivers to get the trash for that task, and I never done it. I could never achieve it. Could you get a little cutscene after that then? Oh, what cut is weekly? You've learned a few things about foraging. It's Penny's handwriting. I want to get every everyone something they love. Possibly there's no beer. Oh, it's Penny's mother. I keep mixing Penny up with Haley. Fairy rose plum pudding, pink cake grape, leek fried mushroom, beet tulip. Happy days. Right. Tell you what. Oh, let's check the back cave. Because the first time I've ever done the back cave, and it was the wrong choice, apparently, on this new update. I won't say too much. But apparently it was the wrong choice again, apparently. Speaking of which... Right. Yeah, but I've nearly done this. So I'm all better, I can just knock this out now, then. Right, not do it this side, because knowing my luck is going to fall in the water. Sorry. Ah, I didn't think of that actually. I'll try that one out next time actually. I didn't think about the farms as well, because you only get mostly get trash from that as well, don't you? I bet you that would work actually. Thinking about it, I probably would actually. Needy got this. This should be enough then. Marvellous. Oh, literally by the sink. Literally spot on a thousand as well. Literally a spot on a thousand. You couldn't make, you couldn't script that. Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Even if it was like... I don't know. I mean, it's useful to have. I suppose that does bring the challenge in on creating your farm, but... Yeah, I agree. I wish there was something you could do with it to give it more of a practical use. Right. Well, let's sell one of them a minute. Get that sold. I'll keep the cheese. Duck me all in that. I'll box the re Ooh, better get into bed actually. Yeah, I can't think what they could introduce though. Like I mean would say perhaps like 
I don't know, like a flotation device or something. So you can perhaps plant certain trees on it. Because obviously it's got a constant water source then, haven't it? But that doesn't sound like a good idea. I literally made that up on the spot, like. But yeah, I wish there was something you could do a bit more creative with the with the water. Oh, let's... Ah, we got this squid fest today. Where is that then? Squid fest has begun. Oh, well, I better get my rod then. I'm not going to get far without that. Yeah, that's true, actually. Yeah. Fish pond, yeah. Or make it... Yeah, that would make sense if you could make them into that. Yeah. Let's see what you mean now. That makes better sense, actually. Because obviously the fish ponds take up more space on the farm. But I've never really done the fish pond, though. I think I've only done it once on a personal playthrough. For, um... When you do the community centre, you've got to do. You've got to reconstruct the Georgia Mart then, haven't you? But that's the only time I think I've ever done it. And that's because I couldn't find another prismatic shard, I think. Right, I think the Squid Fest is down. I'm assuming it's down here. Or is it going to be in. in the beach? Right, it's going to be at the beach, I think. Let's have a juicy gander at the beach then. Ooh, red snapper. Oh, copy those. Oh, I might need that actually. Right. Oh, and I got a token as well. Yeah, I mean, I don't really know. Rock to line, oh, easy get. Um, I mean, all I even understand on the fish ponds is that the fish can get quite demanding with what they want to breed, apparently, because they can put X amount in. And they'll make the carv they'll make caviar then, don't they? But that's all I can see it being a benefit, if I'm honest. Oh, he's not even working today. It's fr Friday, isn't it? I think that's the only drawback with the community centre. Is granted PA starts opening seven days a week, but then Clint shuts on a Friday. Right. But then you do also get the geode crusher off him after a while. So he's sort of replaceable. Which is a bit of a shame. Bless him. But right, so welcome to Squid Fest. What can I do for you? Explanation. It's a squid fishing challenge. If you can hit our daily catch targets, you win prizes. Check the sign to the left. We also put special bait in the water so the squid are active all day. Oh right, okay. And it's the one, and again, I've done it again. Yeah, I got 19 bait. But it's got a warp. The Willy's warp shop is open. Yes, it is. Yeah, because there's another, another event earlier in the year. And I completely missed it. Completely and utterly missed it. Until like the last two hours. And then when I did start joining in, to get a last minute join in, I ran out of bait. And then all my inventory was full, so I couldn't catch any more fish. <laughs> so that was great. That was very enjoyable. Oh, there we are. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, 
Aha. Amazing. Yeah, because I think there was two new feature events introduced to the 1.6. This is one of them. I think another one then is the Trout Derby, and that's the one I missed. Typically. Seaweed. Funny looking, not funny looking squid, but. I've got to keep an eye on the time as well. I've got to pick my daughter up at quarter past three. It's currently half past two at the minute, so. Got to keep an eye on the time. I can't imagine she'd be impressed. I left her there in school, especially on a Friday. She'll be there all weekend then, bless her. <laughs> Mind that's not that doesn't sound like a bad idea. This shame is frowned upon. <laughs> oh, tuna. Oh. There we are. Oh. <laughs> yeah, innit? Mind you, she's doing better in school than I ever did at the minute. Fair do to her. I mean, she still doesn't like school the same as me. But at least she's taking part. Like, she's willing to give things a go like and me. It just, it just, school just wasn't for me, in fairness. Oh. Was that the um the, the church one in Aberdeen? Was it or? Because my daughter calls. Because I think my missus showed my daughter that school. Ah, oh, St John's is it? I think she showed her that school once because that's where my missus used to go. And my daughter calls that the unicorn school now because of the logo. Oh, sorry, really, I forgot you ship fish there, didn't you? Ah, oh, that's the one. Yeah. Oh, I. I I, I was going to say I heard of it, but I don't recall ever seeing it. Where was it then? Well, for a squid fest, it's not much squid here, is it? Yeah, if you go... Oh, it's where the new super school is, and there's a come days up there then, isn't it? Off the roundabout. Before, well, by Abadeir Town if you turn right, but turn left, that's come day road, isn't it? Or nearish by. Oh, yeah, because you've got the new roundabout with the school, but there. Turn right to go into the town for Abadeir, and turn left then. Is that come day road, isn't it? Oh, I know. I know, yeah. Yeah, because my, my father-in-law lives in Irvine. Oh, I think I know now, eh? I don't know. Oh, bloody Elliot. Get your own personal space he wants. There we are. I'm not having much luck with this squid, am I? I've got one. Oh, never. I'll fit you to him. I've always wanted to give Minecraft a go, but I see my daughter playing it now and again on her tablet. It, it could be because it's a tablet version. Oh, I think I know where you are now, yeah. I'll have to look on the map in a bit to try and confirm it. I think I know where you are now. But yeah, my daughter now and again dabbles in Minecraft on her tablet, and it could be because it's a tablet version. It feels like it needs a controller for it to properly experience it. I might give her a go one day, you know. Oh. Now, ah, this has got to be a squid. Well, it hasn't got to be, but I wish it was. Yes, there we are. There we are. No, 
There we are. Do I have to do anything with that? I'm dead. Yeah, Minecraft probably would be alright with mouse and keyboard in Venus. For some games, I prefer keyboard and mouse. Uh, there we are, like Two Point Hospital, World War for the Overworlds, that sort of game. Like games like this then. I obviously started playing this with a keyboard and mouse until I discovered... Ah, I messed that up. Until I discovered then how to use game controllers for them. And for this game now, I would rather use a controller. But there's some games I still prefer mouse and keyboard for. Like Age of Empires would be another one I would use a mouse and keyboard for. Oh, oh, come on. Aha, happy days. Oh, it's a myth, one. I thought I had more than that. Yeah, I never realised how much better it would be with a controller for, for Stardew Valley, because I, I knew no different at the time. But once I, once I realised it would work, I can't remember, I think I bought the controller mainly for Call of Duty Cold War. Because I play that personally, because I'm rubbish at the game, but I love it. But I had it for I had it for that originally, and I I thought one day then oh because I noticed on Steam controller compatibilities and stuff, and I thought oh, I'd give it a go like, and I did it first, and on Traveler's Rest, and that's a similar sort of setup to this, not not the same in regards to farming, but the same sort of actions and stuff. So I thought oh well if it works for Traveler's Rest, which is still in production, still being made and tested and all that. It must work for this, and it did, and you know what? So much easier. And I do it for... I, I'm using it as well for my Pokemon Leaf Green playthrough at the minute as well, which... That's just reminding me, i got to do a recording on that soon. Because I've neglected that for a few weeks. But for the games like that as well, like, the games like that for Game Boy is easy enough for the keyboard, don't get me wrong, but it's just more comfier with the controller, so I don't mind either all for that. But for this game, definitely controller all day. I'm much happier with the controller for this game. Especially when you learn all the triggers and stuff then. But going from this then to my Switch version, all the buttons are the wrong way around. So I gotta so I remember I gotta remember then to remember that I'm on the Switch sometimes. I'm half tempted to buy if my daughter's PS5 this game again. And that'd be the third copy that I got then. Considering it's a squid fest, there's not many squid here, is there? I've got three so far. If I can get five... Oh, that's not one. Snap it, if anything. Alright. Well, so for any game then, or? <laughs> I'm not winning. I think I've pretty much done... Oh, I'm trying to think. No, I, I must have had Final Fantasy VIII over three generations of console. I had it for my PS1. I had, no, I had it for a PC 1.0 years ago then. And I also, and I've also got it on the Switch at the minute now, the remastered version. And I think that might be the same for Final Fantasy IX as well. But I have got Final Fantasy X on the Switch at the minute. I bought it second hand in CEX. Ah, oh, come on. Ooh. Ugh. Nuts. I've been meaning to pick up Final Fantasy X again, actually. I started doing a live of it, but then this update came out. So <laughs> I've carried on with this for now. Oh no, that's what it was. I started doing Final Fantasy X live streaming. And then I discovered Two Point Campus. That's it, and then I started doing that. Yeah, I, I, gen I, I like 8, 9 and 10 the best. I never really ventured on to anything after that. 
I don't know why, I got Final Fantasy 13 here for my PS3, which is literally right there for me. I've connected it to the PC and everything, I've got it all set up on OBS. But my old controller for it is just seeing better days, like the battery has just died to death. So I do need to get a refurbished one if I'm honest, but it's easy to say refurbished PS3 controllers, la la la. But are they refurbished though? So I wouldn't want to be buying someone else's shoddy knacker controller like I've currently got because I've already got a shoddy knackered one. I don't need another one like. I might just buy like a cheap aftermarket one in the box. At least I know then where I stand with it. So I think I did have that PS3 controller working for a bit. But it kept connecting to the PC. Which is not what I wanted. I think I sorted the settings out in Steam now to stop it connecting. Of course, when the PS3 controller then was trying, it was just constantly try, try tap into the PC. Super tomato, what's that? That's to do with controller settings, is it? Or because the PS3 controller for a bit tried controlling the PC, then when I tried disconnecting it, then it was just making all the noises to uh, try and connect all the time, and it just made my PC act weird then. But I'm putting that down to the fact the battery was knackered as well. Like, even though I told it to stop doing it. Ah, oh, right, okay. Shopping Cardiff. Oh, you know what? I recognise that. Huh? I'm actually going to write that down. Super Tomato Cardiff. PS3 controller. Maybe I'll look them up actually. Because I mean, because there's plenty of websites that say we do refurbish this, that, and the other. We just don't really know. And I don't want to buy brand new because, well, trying to get a brand new one is probably like ends teeth for the minute now. Because they're getting on a bit. This has got to be a squid. Come on. Uh, Alba, bloody albacore. Oh, wow. Oh, so they've got some of the older stuff then. Another albacore, I think. Yeah. yeah I'm not going to reach that easy, am I? Tell you what, let's, if I do... Uh, not quite. What if? Aha! I'll do it. Five. I think that's all I can do in it, I think. Oh, no, it was eight. Ooh! Winter seeds. That'll do. Right. Get shot of them. Coffee is life. And, well, he doesn't want that, so... I'll put that in the bin as well. With deluxe bait. Well, I think I'll just stay out here now until late. If I can grab... I don't think I'll give the grab three more now. Because I thought it was five was the max, I thought. Nah. Oh, my new chest. Oh, mine have got no room. Yeah, I'll give them a go, actually, guys. Thanks for that. Appreciate that. Head in. Lost book. For the lost book, the library's been expanded. Marvellous. Because that's a shop I haven't been in a good while. It's Forbidden Planet in Cardiff. Don't even know if it's there anymore. That's how long it's been like. I haven't been to Cardiff socially for ages, thinking about it. Uh, 
Oh, the core. Don't think I'm gonna have much like. Yeah, I imagine it would be there. Because, I mean, that's something that sort of keeps on going through the years, like, especially with like all the Marvel films that have come out the last couple of years and all the merchandise from that. There's still going to be a big following sort of, for that sort of thing. So I imagine it would be. Oh, oh, do I... Is there... I think this is another squid, I think. Yes. And a chest. Trying to think what I want to keep, I definitely. Ah, I can get rid of that. Yeah, 2019. I mean, there's a good chance it could still be there. But all we got to consider is what happened in 2020, I suppose. And a lot of shops did unfortunately close. But it doesn't mean to say they. I'll have to look at that after, actually. Tell you what. Got, I gotta look at it now. We're in Planet Cardiff. Gotta know now. Yeah, it's still open. Still open. That's good to know, actually. That's good to know, actually. Yeah, they're still open. Happy days. Getting late. Right, I'm gonna vamoosh through the earring. Ah, oh, shame I couldn't get eight. Oh, who are you? Don't mind me, I'm just here for the bulk squid prices. <laughs> oh, all right. Oh, that was worthwhile, even for the fish amount, for the monies. In fairness. I mean, we missed the book sale, damn. But, because I couldn't get to it last time. Because my pick was in for upgrade and it was stolen in the way. Yeah, five thirty. Yeah, yeah. It was. I was just generally surprised it was still there. I mean, I just didn't think it would have survived the last couple of years, like with the way it's gone, like, and with all the restrictions they're putting in Wales now, it's just silly at the minute. I see. We oh, get those in the ground. Actually, don't know. Three, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ah, no. Damn, spread them a bit too much, Ant. Quick, get to bed. Ha, ha sleep for the night. Yeah, I know what you mean. I mean, they want to introduce a congestion charge in Cardiff now even though they've got rid of all the bus all the park and rides public transport is unreliable it's expensive because there we are I live in Tom Pentra for my partner to go to Triorchy on the bus for her my daughter it can cost like the best part of five six pound return it's like and I can get about there we are I can get about six litres of LPG up the road from me for my car and that'll probably last us four days, back and forth. It's just not worth it, man. I think treasure doubled. Oh. I don't know which one to choose. I think I'm better off doing that. Right, i got to make a move anyway. i got to pick my daughter up now in about ten minutes. Oh. So, again, thanks, thank you guys for doing the raid earlier. I appreciate that. That's the first time I've ever had that. So I, was, I really wasn't expecting that. That's great. Yeah, so we've done, well, 5 hours and 12 minutes at the minute now, so that was longer than I expected we wanted to be on here for an hour. <laughs> but um, I ended up getting carried away then. So yeah, 5 hours and 12 minutes, that's not bad going. Yeah, but again, thanks to Nairi, mate, and Queen Creek, oh, appreciate that. Not sure when I'll get on you next now, but I'll get on your ASAP, basically. Oh, right, happy days. Catch you all again. Thank you, mate. Thank you, everyone. Right, wait, 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 where are we? There we are. And that. 
and the 